Yes, it is alive. I'm live. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. I'm just getting set up. So, one second. How's everyone doing today? I'm trying to go live both on YouTube and TikTok. So I'm setting up my two different devices. I'm going to set up the music. Of course, none of my devices are charging. <laughs> I'm going to be working on this pattern today. It is Nomi 2012. It is a uh, like boiler jumpsuit. That is the project for today. My necklace. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Hey, Tony Smith, how are you? Okay, this should be working. <laughs> not connected, not connected, not connected. Okay, let me get my music, if I can find it. How is everyone doing this morning? I think it's on my other account. Hold on, let me switch accounts. We have to have copyright free music and I have a playlist. Here it is. <laughs> it's not the best music, but we make it work. <laughs> It works for what we have to do, right? I'm not sure if I want to sew or if I want to use my serger. Why is nothing working today? I think just to be safe, I will sew.
yeah. And then if I want to go back and insurge, I'll go back and insurge. But I think just to be safe, I'll go. I'll definitely. So let me go live. How much bargain detergent does it take to clean as well as time? Well, I don't know why that video wasn't working. Yeah, we're definitely going to sew first. Okay, we're all set up. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. <laughs> Dana, how have you been? Both Dana's. I have both Dana's in here. Lee, thank you so much for the fire. I really appreciate it. So I am streaming on TikTok, but I am also on YouTube. Today, we are sewing Nomi 2012. Nomi 2012. This is what we're working on today. It is the first time that I've done this jumpsuit and first time that I've really done anything like this. I've done like women's jumpsuits before, but I've never done like a boiler suit like this. So this will be my first time. I'm excited. It doesn't look too, too difficult. I have everything prepped already, so we're good to go. All my pieces are cut out. Interfacing is done. So variation on the boiler suit. I'm going to show this weekend done. Oh, yeah, everyone loves to make it in crochet. Hey, Andre. Everyone loves to make it in, not crochet, denim. I've seen a lot of people make it in denim. I unfortunately didn't have enough fabric, so I'm using Ankara. I am using this green floral Ankara. It has little like daisies on it. Good morning. So this is the fabric that I will be using today. So let's hope it turns out cute. <laughs> Let's hope it turns out cute. Fingers crossed. Here's hoping. <laughs> Here's hoping. <laughs> I'm just going to move my sewing machine over. I'm going to be using my... Hey, Joy, how are you? I'm going to be using my Burnett B79 today. If y'all are on TikTok, make sure you're tapping the screen. Help us get to 10,000 likes. Not me dropping everything. Hey, Joyful Stacey, how are you? And if you're over on YouTube, make sure that you like like yeah right here <laughs> make sure that you like the live video it helps with the algorithm um yeah yeah help us get some likes good morning miss d how are you if anyone has any questions let me know beautiful oh thank you skittles thank you sweetie darling i appreciate it I figured this fabric would be something fun and something different. You're going to carnival tomorrow. Ah, that sounds like fun. Hey, Rochester, Pamela King, how are you? How are you? If you're new here, welcome. My name is Terrence Williams. I run my small business, Terrence Williams Designs, where I make ethically sourced and sustainably produced clothing and accessories. Uh, my website, Terrence Williams Designs, is linked in my bio. 
Uh, everything is genderless, everything is size inclusive. I make everything right here in my sewing studio. So today I'm working on a jumpsuit for myself. Again, Know Me 2012. This is what I'm working on today. I'm just setting up my sewing machine. I have to grab the thread. So, and then we can start prepping and sewing and getting ready. It's gonna be, it's gonna be quite the, um, <laughs> quite the undertaking today. I don't think it's gonna be too bad. I don't think it's gonna be too bad, but we'll see. And again, if you are over here on TikTok, if you could just tap the screen, help us get to 10,000 likes. If you haven't joined the team, make sure you join the team. Send a little heart me. And if you can help with the goal of the day, it is the little crowns. I would be very appreciative. This is not the green that I want. <laughs> not the green I want. I guess not. I guess this is it. This is the closest I got. Okay. Well, we will make it work. I'm good. I'm good. So y'all can watch from two different places. You can watch here on TikTok or you can watch me over on YouTube. I am streaming live from both places. I'm live both on TikTok and YouTube. Let's talk about the Usher concert. <laughs> um, I have some thoughts. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. I definitely have some thoughts. <laughs> I thought his song choice was really interesting. Uh, poor Alicia Keys. <laughs> poor Alicia Keys. Um, <laughs> Bum Gia, good morning. Hi, Chosen, how are you? Do I already have... Oh, I already have one of these wound. There we go. Look at that. How are you, Chosen? Hey, Julian, how are you? Yes. So I cut out the jumpsuit last night and I am making it today. So we are sewing Know Me 2012. Hey, Drew, how are you? Oh, that reminds me. Let me do this. Before I get any requests. Okay. So again, I am streaming over here on TikTok, but I also am streaming live on YouTube. So you can watch from either place. It's like two different vantage points. <laughs> How 
Hi, Linda. Thank you. I hope you have a wonderful day also. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for getting us to 2,000 likes. We are on the road to 10K. We are trying to get to 10,000 likes. You have my YouTube channel. Linda, thank you so much for the heart me and joining the team. I look fab today. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. The headband I'm wearing on my head is the pink velvet headband. It is available on my website, Terrence Williams Designs. It's linked in my bio. What I love about my headbands is that they are adjustable by the knot in the front, so you can make the headbands um, bigger or smaller. First of all, Chosen, I don't see any of your comments aside from top of the morning. That's it. <laughs> That's the only comment I see. <laughs> Hi, Brazil. Hi, Jamaica. Okay, I'm going to get started as Chosen throws a hissy fit. <laughs> um, I don't know what lipstick I'm wearing. It was just a random one in my collection. I'm sure you are stomping right now. Okay, so the first thing that I have to do is make the pockets. So there are three different pockets. There are two on the butt, and then there is one on the front piece. Thank you. Good morning, good morning, good morning. So it wants me to do the pockets first. So I'm going to get my pocket pieces out. And I have to see if I have a zipper. Good morning, good morning, everyone. Hey, Ash. Pants front facing pockets. Okay. Got my pocket pieces. JK Customs, welcome in. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Know me 2012. Know me 2012. Thank you for the heart me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If y'all have not sent a heart me and join the team, make sure you send the heart me and join the team. Press one fourth on upper edge of pocket. Turn upper edge to outside along full bind, forming facing stitch. Okay. Thank you for the little crown. Thank you, thank you, thank you. About an inch. Oh, I don't show up well dressed every morning. 
<laughs> you must not be here every morning because I don't show up well dressed every morning. Hi. <laughs> yes, she does. She does have a, a couple. Um, I've never made one, but she does have a few. On upper edge of pocket, turn upper edge to outside along the fold line and stitch. Okay. I think I forgot to change my my needle. I know I definitely forgot to change my needle. So because it's Black History Month, we are, thank you for the little crown. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because it's Black History Month, um, we are focusing on Black designers. And because, you know, Norris is obvious. <laughs> so that's why I decided to do his, his know me pattern. So we love me, me, G, but it's about the black people this month. <laughs> Good morning. Okay, RV beads. Let me change my needle. I think this one is said I had enough. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You love the fabric. Thank you. It's Ankara. I got this Ankara from Grace of Zesty Couture. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Grace of Zesty Couture is where I got this fabric from. Thank you for the rose. Hey, Lisa Ann, good morning. Yes, yes, I'm on this morning. Um, I you were on last night, caught the end. I cut out the jumpsuit, and now we are sewing it today. Where's my little tool? It makes it easier for me. All of night pads are designed for a perfect night's sleep. Up to 100% free protection, always. Are you turning your back on the moment of the Cascade, dare to dish to Good morning, Tammy. How are you? Welcome in, welcome in.
Hopefully this helps a little bit. Did everyone enjoy? Paolo, hello, how are you? Did everyone enjoy the Super Bowl? I do sleep, I do. You enjoyed it? Did y'all enjoy the halftime show, Usher's halftime show? Poor Alicia Keys. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I have to say. Poor Alicia Keys, child. I feel like Alicia's voice is, is never really cooperating. <laughs> never really cooperating. <laughs> Poor thing. You said it was probably the night air. We'll go with that. <laughs> we will go with that. Hey, Lil Sabs, how are you? She did. She did pull it together. Um, I don't know. I don't think it was a bad halftime performance by any means. Definitely was not bad by any means. I just wasn't like overly enthusiastic about it, you know? You think Usher made her nervous? Good morning, Linda. How are you? You know what? The outfit was with the outfit was made by Dolce and Gabbana, and I don't like Dolce and Gabbana. <laughs> so yeah, I didn't like it. <laughs> if the outfit was made by anyone else, I would have loved it, but because it was made by Dolce and Gabbana, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> I am making Nomi to 2012, so it is this jumpsuit. For the people on YouTube and the people on TikTok, I am making a jumpsuit or boiler suit, whatever you want to classify it as. Yeah. If any, again, if anyone else had made the outfit, I would have liked it, but. <laughs> we do not do Dolce & Gabbana over here.
I think his performance, I, again, I don't think it was bad, but I think... I think we've had, thank you for the heart puff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think we've had like more memorable performances. So I always think, um, obviously Rihanna's is gonna be memorable, not only because it was last year, but because everyone was doing the choreography and the dances after Beyonce's is, memorable because it's Beyonce. Katy Perry's, which I think surprisingly is one of my favorite halftime show performances. Um, just because uh, Katy Perry did exactly like what she is known for and what she does. <laughs> um, what did I do with my scissors? Katy Perry is a pop girly, okay? She does pop music like no other. She has so many hit songs, and she did them all. I don't know. I just think that is, like, a very memorable. And, of course, everyone was making fun of the sharks and, like, every, oh, that madness. Um, Michael Jackson, Prince. You know what I mean? Even Madonna, Janet Jackson, yes. How could we forget Janet Jackson? Even the Super Bowl when it was like in sync and Britney Spears and Aerosmith, like there are iconic Super Bowl performances. I guess you could even say Bruno Mars. Um, yeah, but I don't think anyone, I don't know what I did with my scissors, y'all. I don't know. I don't think we're going to look back on this performance and be like, oh my gosh, it was iconic and revolutionary and changed the way we think about Super Bowl halftime performances. Good morning, Anna. It was all right, but it could have been better. Yeah. Not the best ever, but it was good. I agree. I agree with that sentiment. I was mildly entertained. <laughs> I was mildly entertained. Ah, oh, nail pops. Thank you so much for the little crown. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> Turn upper edge to outside long folded line for me. Facing such a long seam line. On raw edges, trim allowance and facing. Turn corners right side out. Press under raw edges. Okay. So I'm turning the pockets I actually kind of hate <laughs> you were forced to listen to the halftime show you don't like Usher
Uh, you were forced to listen to the game. And what do we think about Beyonce? Dropping new music, Super Bowl commercials. What do we think? She looked gorgeous last night. She looked absolutely stunning. Uh, you don't support most celebrities these days. Well, <laughs> to each their own. <laughs> Good morning. Hey, Javi. Javi, I feel like you've been up all morning and all day. Hi, yes, it's Raps. How are you? Thank you for joining over on YouTube. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So in case y'all don't know, I am streaming on TikTok and I am streaming on YouTube also. So you can definitely join from more than one place. Don't forget to check out my website. Not Alicia off keys. <laughs> we were just talking about her. I said, poor Alicia keys, poor thing. <laughs> Not Alicia off keys. Oh my gosh. How did I know that was going to happen? <laughs> Good morning. Which dress? We've been working on multiple dresses. <laughs> multiple dresses, multiple jumpsuits. We've been busy this week. I look cute, thank you. Usher was everything, you liked it? Thank you for the heart me, Javi. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for the heartbeat. Good morning, Karen. How are you? You may go to his Detroit concert. That'll be fun. I know a lot of people have said that they're getting tickets to his concert. Thank you so much for the heartbeat. Summertime rain and joining the team. 
Hey, happy dancer. How are you? Good morning. I figured I'd get a little dressed up today. <laughs> Put a little bit of effort into my look. <laughs> Again, if y'all have not joined the team over on TikTok, make sure you join the team. Send a little heart me. And after you join the team, you're able to send exclusive gifts like the team bracelet. And it helps us in the popular live ranking. So thank you so much to everyone who has joined the team and sent the team bracelet. I really appreciate it. Okay, we have one pocket done. <laughs> All that we have it's one pocket done. <laughs> we have uh two more to go. Oh, let me flip it. Thundercats, thank you for the heart me. Brenda, thank you for the heart me. I appreciate it. Nail Pops, thank you for the little crown earlier and the gifts. I appreciate it. Thank you for the team bracelet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Y'all can send uh, 40 team bracelets a day. Y'all can send 40 a day. So if you have an extra 80 coins laying around, send the team bracelet. <laughs> Taking care of me. Yes, yes. We say that all the time. It's like the analogy when you're on a plane and the oxygen masks come down. You have to put your oxygen mask on first because how can you help everyone else if you can't? even help yourself. It's definitely important to take time for yourself and care for yourself. Okay. We're on the second pocket. Danielle, thank you so much for the team bracelets. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If we could get in the popular live ranking today, that would be amazing. Also, again, don't forget to check out my website, Chance Williams Designs. Orders have shipped this morning. More orders will be shipping this week. I did not know these little pockets would be this time consuming. <laughs> and the funny thing is I don't even use back pockets on jeans, so, or pants. So these pockets are literally just for show, <laughs> not for practicality.
so I hope they're worth it, child. No, this is Ankara, so it's like a cotton. It doesn't have stretch. It is a woven with no stretch. Hello to everyone on YouTube. If you are on YouTube, if you could like the live, like the video, please. It helps us over on YouTube. If you're over here on TikTok, you can like the live, help us get to 10,000 likes. We're usually there by now. Y'all are slacking today. <laughs> Maybe because it's a Monday morning. <laughs> Second pocket is done. Starting to think the pockets are more trouble than they're worth. <laughs> okay, Javi. <laughs> Enjoy. Hello, Grandma Rose. How are you? Hmm. Okay, last pocket. <laughs> my, oh, my, oh, my. I love this Ankara though. Again, it's from Grace of Zesty Couture. It is green and has little daisies all over it. This is what the Ankara looks like, again, from Grace of Zesty Couture. I get all my Ankara from Grace. Danielle, thank you so much for the team bracelets. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, yeah, I do love what I do, so. 
I literally just said that on Instagram this morning that I'm so blessed I get to wake up and do what I love every day. So it's a blessing. I'm I'm very grateful. I try not to take it for granted. Even though sometimes it can be annoying and frustrating and difficult. I'm still very blessed. Very, very blessed. Thank you for the rose. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, Carmen, I just decided to get on a little early. Um, yeah, we're gonna make a day of it. I feel like this, I feel like this is gonna take a while. <laughs> so I decided to get on a little early and I was just feeling restless. Like I was awake and just wanted to start. Just wanted to start. Hey, Evelyn. Glad you're home. Welcome in, Renee. Welcome in. So I am streaming both on YouTube, if you want to watch me on YouTube, and I am on TikTok. If you are on YouTube, um, if you could like the video, and if you're on TikTok, if you could like the uh, live also. We're trying to get to 10,000 10, likes. <laughs> Thank you. It's like two different angles, two different, two different vantage points, so... We're trying something new. We are trying something new. I didn't have enough time to set up StreamYard last night. I, listen. Prepping this pattern. <laughs> Between prepping this pattern and dealing with all the Beyonce madness last night, it was a lot. It was a lot. You just finished CrossFit. How it go? Oh, you had kidney stones. Oof. That's rough. Well, I'm glad you're home. <laughs> I'm trying, Carmen. I'm trying. I keep telling people I am over on YouTube. You can watch the live stream on YouTube. Terrence Williams Designs is my handle. Welcome in, Monica. We are trying to get monetized over on YouTube, and we just need watch hours. So you can, you can you know, send, send me... Send me a little crown, send me a galaxy, and then go watch on YouTube. <laughs> thank you, Renee, for the little crown. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello. Hey, Jess. Hello. 
Hey, Danielle, how are you? Thank you for switching over. I appreciate it. Okay, y'all, the pockets are done. Monica, thank you for the rose. K-Chai, hello, hello, hello. The pockets are done. I, I have to attach them now. <laughs> Sewing the pockets is one thing. Attaching them is another one, another thing. Mozo Flow, hello, how are you? Okay, go watch on YouTube today and feel better <laughs> after CrossFit. This is the pattern we're working on today. It is Nomi 2012 Norse's Boiler Jumpsuit. Chanel Cosmetics, hello, how are you? We just did the pockets. <laughs> We've been on live for almost an hour and we have accomplished the pockets. So we're making progress. <laughs> On the outside pin pocket to left bodice front, matching large dot, edge stitch close to side and lower edges, top stitch from edge. Stitch remaining pockets to pants back section in the same manner. Okay, so bodice front, which is section one. Kayak Faith, thank you so much for the heart me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So piece one. Yes, we are doing, there's my scissors. I found my scissors, yo. Okay, so piece one. Here we go. Hello, sweetie darling. Welcome in. Bodice front one between the large dots. Okay, so this is my left side, and this is my right side. So I want to put it on the left side. Okay. I did. I'm bald. <laughs> I am bald. Thank you all for following. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Terrence Williams, yay! I love it when y'all rock my headbands. It is the best feeling in the world. <laughs> thank you all for the support. Thank you. If y'all have not uh, gone to my website, Terrence Williams Designs, I do uh, make ethically sourced and sustainably produced clothing and accessories. My headbands are a bestseller because they have an adjustable knot in the front. You can make them bigger or smaller by adjusting, ooh, by adjusting the knot. So they fit a variety of different head sizes and shapes. So whether you have lots of hair, no hair, locks, braids, uh, straight hair, curly hair, wavy hair, 4C hair. Um, they adjust to fit a bunch of different head sizes. So, and there are prints and patterns. The velvet ones seem to be really popular. There are a few of this pink velvet left. These are really nice because you can pull them down over your ears and they become ear warmers. So they keep your ears warm. 
I love the velvet ones and the sweater weather ones. They are literally made from sweater material. So they keep your ears warm. It's like wearing a sweater on your head. They're so nice. Actually, we'll show y'all one. This is one of them. So they're really soft, really warm. Um, perfect for the fall and winter season. And again, these are available on my website, Terrence Williams Designs. Free domestic shipping. So yeah. Thank you for the heart, me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. <clears throat> yes, I am on both platforms. I am. We are, we're doing both today. <laughs> we are doing both today. If y'all have not liked the live over on YouTube, please like the live. It helps. And if you have not liked the live over here on TikTok, help us get to 10,000 likes. If you can help with the goal of the day, it is the little crown. Stacy, welcome in. How are you? How are you feeling? I am attaching my pocket right now to the left side. Sweetie darling, thank you so much for the heart me. I appreciate it. Sweetie darling, thank you so much for helping achieve the goal. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm doing good. You're going over to YouTube. Okay, Kayak Bay, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I believe so, yes. To do membership subscriptions on YouTube, I believe you do have to wait to get monetized. I believe so. Let's do uh, roses. How far am I? So all I need is watch hours. Right now I have about almost 900. So in order to get to the monetiz monetization level I want to, it's, it's 4,000. So I have about 3,000 more watch hours to go to get to my goal. Okay, we will do roses. There we go. Hey, Jewel Art House. Stacy, thank you so much for the paper crate. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, Charles. We are making this jumpsuit. This Norris boiler suit. And I'm making it in this Ankara fabric. So it is Nomi 2012. I look like a ray of sunshine. Thank you. Nylon, welcome in, welcome in. In case y'all don't know, I am streaming on TikTok, but I'm also also over on YouTube. I am also streaming over on YouTube as well. If you want to watch from YouTube, you'll help me get my uh, monetization hours. Thank y'all so much for the for the roses. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I asked everyone yesterday what Ankara I should use, and they all picked this one. So what's for I'm starving actually. I didn't even have breakfast. Hey kayak faith, how are you? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Vibrant love, good morning. Okay, I'm attaching the pocket to the front.
Good morning, Juju Jam. Welcome in. Hey, Sabs, how are you? I am going to be on for the rest of the day. Oh, thank you, Gwendolyn. Thank you. I am going to be on. I'm going to try to finish this jumpsuit today, which is, it's a large undertaking, but, you know, we'll see. So this is the front with the pocket. Hold on. The front with the pocket. Okay. Okay. Not me getting hype, and I've only, only done one one thing. <laughs> we got twenty more, twenty six more steps to go, y'all. <laughs> yes. What is your question, Stacy? Good morning, Debbie. How are you? Okay, I'm going to grab the pants. I have to do the back pants pocket, so section 11. You picked up a wedding gown pattern? Oh, wow. Have fun with that. <laughs> back pants, okay. Vintage. Hey, Cake Karen. How are you? Thank you all for joining over on YouTube. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, going live helps with watch hours and subscribers, yes. So we, if you go live, you do get watch hours. And I think you can game them a lot quicker than if you are just posting videos. But I think they both go hand in hand. Because there's a creator, Tiffany. She, Tip Stitch, she went live like once. And she got monetized. But I think it's because she posts regularly and consistently on her YouTube channel. So I think that's how she was able to really monetize. So you don't just have to go live. You can post videos too. You can do both. You can do both. I definitely think it's quicker to get the watch hours by going live. But not everyone has the time, the effort, the energy, the capacity Sometimes it's easier for people to make videos. Um, but yeah, going both helps. Yes, weekly videos. Well, that's good that you do weekly videos because here's the thing. There are some people who are only going live and that that's great, that's wonderful. But um, if you you get to the highest tier, monetization tier, where you can have ads on your videos. Oh, that man is cute. 
where you have ads on your videos, um, <laughs> you're not going to be able to get ad revenue if you don't have any um, any videos. So making videos is just as important as going live. That man is fine as hell. He is cute as shit. Hello, sir. <laughs> you, <laughs> I am selfish. I am. <laughs> I got a little distracted. He really distracted me. He was cute. <laughs> You're welcome, Stacy. Anytime, anytime. Good morning. I did get y'all know I always get distracted. <laughs> y'all always, y'all know I get distracted. I can't help it. Now, why are these dots? Oh, thank you, Christine. <laughs> Listen, don't come for me, hubby. Don't come for me. I'm trying to see if I... Okay, they are supposed to be slanted. I was like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't know if I accidentally slanted the dots or if they were supposed to be slanted, but they're supposed to be slanted. Okay. Good morning, Val. Jane Nicole Collection, so unique. Welcome in, everyone. Again, thank you to everyone who is joining over on YouTube. I really appreciate it. Helping me get my watch hours and to get monetized. I appreciate it. Even if you can't stay the whole time and you just have me playing in the background, I really appreciate it. Uh, and to everyone over here on TikTok, if you could help get us to 10,000 likes, if you can help with the goal, it is roses. It is roses. There's 61 people, 50 people in here. So if 10 of y'all sent a rose, we would be at the goal, right? Yeah. <laughs> Brie, Crazy Stitches, thank you for sharing the live. I appreciate it. Okay, this top is done. For now, I'm just going to put it right here for a second. Thank you, Renee. <laughs> Stacy, thank you so much for the roses. I really appreciate it. Adriana, thank you so much for the roses. I appreciate it. Yes, dream of me, Renee. Dream of me. <laughs> For those of you who are interested, um, I am having a TikTok Live 101 class. It's going to be March 2nd at 4 o'clock Eastern, 3 o'clock Central. And it will go over everything TikTok about going live on TikTok how to monetize on TikTok, grow your community, 
all of the different features, gifts, battling, it'll go over everything. Um, so if you've ever been curious about going live on TikTok and you didn't really quite understand it, this is the perfect class. Or if you do go live on TikTok and maybe you don't get a lot of people in your lives, um, maybe you don't get a lot of gifts, maybe you don't get a lot of interaction, this will also be the perfect class for you because it will uh, go over best practices and how to increase not only your retention and the money that you can make on here, but also help you build a better bond and connection with your audience. So you can go to my website, Chance Williams Designs, and it is under the small business consultations, or you can click uh, the link in my bio. It's the second link in my bio, TikTok Live 101. Ash, thank you so much for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. How are you this morning? And that goes for everyone on YouTube. Also, if you go to my website, Terrence Williams Designs, you can sign up for the class. There are still plenty of spots available. Husband said we share everything in this household. He <laughs> hey, Renee's husband. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Okay, back pockets are pinned. I'm about to sew them on. You are at work board, listen. We will take you board at work anytime. <laughs> we will take you board at work anytime. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome in everyone. I am just attaching my back pockets to the pants, the pants part of the spoiler suit. Not grinning from ear to ear. I can't. <laughs> Listen, we love to make the men smile. <laughs> we love to make the men smile, child. Thank you for the heart, me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, the back pocket is on. Valencia, thank you so much for the roses. Back pocket is on. On one side, now I have to do the other. And then after that, we can actually start getting into like the meat and potatoes of putting this together. Have to do this slight prep work. <laughs> Listen, it wouldn't be the first time that I was someone's side piece. <laughs> I have played this the side piece role many times. <laughs> Floor, you are crazy. What are you talking about? <laughs> Floor, if you're not sending a galaxy, 
Floor, if you're not sending a galaxy, be quiet. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I have been the side piece many times, okay? <laughs> and I didn't complain, not once. <laughs> Javi, thank you so much for the team bracelet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, back pocket pieces are on. Thank you for the rose. Kima, thank you, thank you, thank you. We got to 10,000 likes. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. 18 viewers, 18 likes over on YouTube. Thank you all so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Pockets are on. <laughs> Again, for those of you who are just joining, I am working on Know Me 2012. It is Norris's jumpsuit. I am using this gorgeous Ankara from Grace of Zesty Couture. It is green with little daisies on it. This is the pattern. This is the fabric. Also, if you are new here, Hello, my name is Terrence Williams. I run my small business, Terrence Williams Designs, where I make ethically sourced and sustainably produced clothing and accessories. You can shop my website, terrencewilliamsdesigns.com. It is linked in my bio. I do headbands, dusters, infinity scarves, caftan dresses. Everything is made to order, genderless and size inclusive. So you enter in your sizing information and then I make everything for you custom. So that is my business. That's my baby. And we're on here sewing. <laughs> if anyone has any questions, let me know. Good morning, New York. I miss New York. I really miss New York a lot. Dr. Za, hello, hello, hello. We are going to stitch the back edges of the bodice back. See, this has a lot of top. I don't know if I want to do the top stitching. A money talks. Listen, Renee. <laughs> Good morning. Hey, Aisha, how are you? Let me get my back bodice pieces. Those are my, that's my sleeve. The facing, right front pants, left front pants. Okay, bodice back. I know it's been a minute. Hey, St. Vincent, Susie, welcome in. Once I have a little bit more time, it's not even time. Once I am not uh, depressed. <laughs> Once 
so I'm not depressed, Renee. Um, <laughs> then I'll feel more inclined. <laughs> I did cut my hair. I did. Ah, oh, thanks for hanging out, Stacy, Beverly. Thank you for the flowers. I did cut my hair off. I, I don't know. <laughs> I was going through it. So I said, let me just, not I was going through it. I am going through it. So I said, let me just cut it all off, child. I'm tired. <laughs> I am tired. Right now I'm stitching the back pieces together. It wants me, oh, it wants me to um, edge stitch and top stitch, but I don't think I want to do that. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> I just feel like maybe if it was like in denim, I would feel more inclined to... Miss Carol, you're going to make this jumpsuit too? I haven't seen a lot of people make it. I have not seen a lot of people make it, but I think it has potential. I remember when it first came out, people were dragging it. People were dragging this for filth. But I saw the potential. Hey, Silver Fox. And that's the thing. You have to see the potential in a pattern. Not everyone's going to get it. Sometimes people lack the vision and they lack the style, so they don't see it. But I saw it from the beginning. So here we are. <laughs> here we are. Yeah, I'm not top stitching. <laughs> okay, I'm going to add the yoke. That is part four. Yeah, I made the executive decision. I'm not top searching. Trying to watch on the computer. Ah, well, welcome in, Angela. Welcome in. Thank you for joining. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You could use a jumpsuit, a boiler suit. Even if y'all just have me on in the background and you're not exactly paying attention, it still helps with my YouTube watch hours, so I still appreciate it. So this is the yoke part I'm attaching to the back. Thank you for helping us get to 10,000 likes. I really appreciate it. Spiritual mother, welcome in, welcome in. I actually don't think this is going to take... I look so radiant. Thank you. Crazy Stitches, thank you for the rose. Thank you. No, this does not call for a lining. The only thing that it calls for is a facing. So I do have my facing pieces cut out, but I will not be adding a lining. Happy so day, crazy stitches. Thank you for the roses. I look amazing this morning. Thank you.
folklore and tradition welcome in it is for me yep it is for me no i am not surging the inside this is the first time that i am making it so i didn't want to surge hey sierra how are you Thank you for the heart puff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I went back and forth about whether I wanted to surge or sew. And I, because I was, it has the pockets, I decided that I was just going to sew it all so I didn't have to jump back and forth between the machines. Some days I'm in the mood to do it, and some days I'm not. And today I'm just not. <laughs> today I am just not. It's so funny because before I was like, I, because when I look at the inside of my garments, I like the look of a surged edge better than just like the open seam. I don't know. It just looks more professional to me. It just looks cleaner. But I know a lot of people who home sew have like the open seams like this. But I've just gotten used to um, having the open seams on the inside and part of it's just being lazy. <laughs> okay, so the back is done with right sides together, pin sleeve to armhole edge with center dots at shoulder seams. Stitch front to back at shorter edges. Okay, so now it wants me to put the front to the back. Oh, here's my front piece. Good morning. Have a blessed day, you too. Okay, I'm pinning the front to the back at the shoulder seams, and then I'm going to attach the sleeve. So I've attached the back pieces and the back yoke. Now I am attaching the front to the back, and I've also added the pockets. I've added the pockets to the pants. I've added the pockets to the front. What does everyone think of Beyonce's new songs? Are we loving the country vibe? Do we think the whole album is gonna be country? What are what are our predictions? What are our thoughts? 
When I tell you everyone was messaging me last night. <laughs> when I tell you everyone was messaging me last night, I thought she died. <laughs> Susie, thank you for the rose. Gwen, good morning. I thought she died. <laughs> I was on live when the, I guess the commercial came on and the announcement dropped. And when I tell you, everyone rushed to my live. <laughs> everyone rushed to my live and they were like, Beyonce, Beyonce. I was like, what happened? What happened? <laughs> they were like, new music. And I was like, okay, okay. <laughs> the flower fabric is nice. Thank you. It is from a grace of zesty couture she sells on clara fabric okay stitching the front to the back now with the right sides together Hey, Kizzy, Adria, hello, welcome in. Thank you all for 13,000 likes, I really appreciate it. How's everyone doing on YouTube? Doing good, doing fine, good, good, good. Attaching the shoulders. Pants side front, pants left front, pants right front sleeve. Here we go. And then these are the pockets. And these are all the facing pieces. Okay. Hi, Ryan. Now I am going to attach the sleeve. I am making uh, this jumpsuit, No Me 2012. 
this is the jumpsuit I am making. And I am making it in this Ankara fabric from Grace of Zesty Couture. Yes, we love the Nomi patterns. Do you have a favorite, Elizabeth? A favorite Nomi pattern or favorite designer? Good morning from Texas. Well, good morning from Texas. I'm in Dallas. With high prime by Solar Stove, you can finally think outside the cardboard box. The best pizza isn't delivered to the front door. It's made in the backyard. It doesn't come from a restaurant. It comes from you. Anywhere can be your favorite pizza spot. Thank you for sharing the live. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We are making a jumpsuit. It's Ankara fabric, so it is stiff until you wash it. Oh, the corny rainbow? Yes, yeah. She always has really fun, uh, fun makes. Hey, Brianna. I'm good. How are you? NC girl, hello, hello, hello. Uh, this is a Burnett B79. I love this machine.
You have a brother Luminaire. Oh, aren't you fancy? Aren't you fancy? I just saw this brother sewing machine. I think it's a sewing machine and embroidery machine. It's huge. And it has a little laser on it. So while you're sewing, you can see, you can sew in a straight line. It's like, Lord. They get fancier and fancier. Fancier and fancier. And I think the new the new Bernina sewing and embroidery machine has a laser on it. Uh, yeah, it, it's pricey. It is definitely very pricey. <laughs> For sure. Nylon, welcome in. Oh, okay, okay. I so my Burnett B seventy nine is a sewing and embroidery machine, and then I have a uh, Bernina eight thirty that is a sewing and embroidery machine. So I have a few machines. I have my. I got my Burnett B79, my Bernina 830. I have a brother, limited edition project runway. Those are the three sewing machines. And then I have sergers. So I have my brother, not brother. I have my Bernina L890. I have my Juki MO1000. I have my brother Lock. And then I have a Bernina MO1000 serger. So quite a few different, quite a few different machines. <laughs> so one sleeve is attached. It looks nice. It looks very nice. Okay, one sleeve attached, attaching the other sleeve now. Hey. <laughs> you, you get to scourge loading the thread for your serger. Listen, anytime y'all want to come over and help me sew, <laughs> y'all are more than welcome to. <laughs> <laughs> Does the fabric determine which machine you use? No. So what determines what machine I use is my mood <laughs> and the project. That's really, really what it is. So this morning, if I'm going to use a sewing machine, not... Nine out of 10 times, it's going to be my Burnett, just because I love it so much. Um, and it's my favorite. 
and because I'm a brand ambassador for them. So they gifted this machine to me. So I'm definitely going to use it. <laughs> but uh, it really came down to this morning, did I want to surge or did I want to sew? And because this is the first time I'm making this jumpsuit, if I made a mistake, I wanted to be able to easily take out the seams. And it's just a lot easier if I sewed it rather than searched it. Um, so for first time projects, when I'm making something, I will usually sew it. And then if I make it again, once I have the confidence and the knowledge, I'll usually search it. LH awesome, hello. So yeah, that's usually that's usually what determines which machine I'm using. Not necessarily the the fabric, but the project. And my mood. Cause I could have easily used my Juki serger and my Burnett for this project, but I was undecisive. I decided just to sew it. <laughs> oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Surging is uh, what you, it's a machine that instead of leaving the edges open and raw, it encloses them. So there's no like fraying or anything like that. And it just leaves a really nice professional finish on the inside of your garment. So it's so it sews it together, but makes it look uh, a little nicer professional as they say. But you don't technically need a serger. I just have always really wanted one. <laughs> and it's made my life a hundred times easier. <laughs> it's made my life a hundred times easier. I think threading it is one of the most difficult aspects of using a serger. But once you thread it and you get it and you understand it, it's so simple. My headband is velvet. It is pink velvet, and it is available on my website, Terrence Williams Designs. There are a few left. Um, yeah, it's adjustable by the knot in the front, so you can make the headband bigger or smaller, depending on your head size. So if you pull it this way, the headband gets tighter. If you pull it this way, the headband gets looser on your head and you can wear it a bunch of different ways with the knot in the front, with the knot in the back. But again, it comes in a bunch of different colors. So it comes in pink and green and purple and blues and a brown and a gold. And it is available on my website, Terrence Williams Designs. Free domestic shipping within the United States. I hand make and design everything. Christian, hello, how are you? Yes, support my little small business, y'all.
Okay, and the sleeves are attached. Stitch bodice front to bodice back at entire underarm seams, matching armhole seams. Press up on the low ones, stitch close to inner. Okay. So we are going to attach the front to the back under under here in the armhole is what we're doing. Darn it. Thank you, Venicia. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Good afternoon. Perfect. Oh, this is coming along so nicely. One side pinned, doing the other side now. Thank you, Abby, for the rose. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sorry, I'm concentrated trying to get all my notches. <laughs> Try to get all my notches together. I'm making a jumpsuit.
Mm, my eyeball. Mm. <laughs> I know today is very zen. <laughs> Usually my lives are a lot more active, but today is a zen concentrated day. why my eye is watering like crazy mm. okay just gonna stitch up the sides now Good morning, Risha. How are you? Working from home, yes. I'm working from home as well. <laughs> I am working from home as well. Gosh, my eyeball. I am making a jumpsuit. Happy Monday, Eros. How are you? Okay. So this is the jumpsuit we are making. It's a boiler suit by Norris. It is Nomi 2012. This is what we're making. 
been a rough money. Oh, well, I hope you feel better. I hope the morning and day gets better for you. So, so far, we have attached the pockets. We have done the back and the yoke. We have now attached the sleeves. So it's coming along well. It's coming along really well. I wish your job was to watch my lives. That would be a very nice job. So it looks like I'm going to be doing a casing for the elastic. Thank you. And then we'll be moving on to the pants. One of the last steps is adding the zipper. Okay, so this stuff, Little Red Retro, hello. Thank you so much for the heart me. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Stitch front casing sections to back casing at side edges. Okay, I'm gonna slip, put this to the side. I'm going to grab it's going as I hoped. It's going really smooth so far. Yeah, it's going It's going good. <laughs> I didn't think the pattern would be difficult. I just knew it would take a little bit of time. So, and I'm just going slow and steady. So, as not to make mistakes. So, I need sections five and six. Stitch front casing sections to back casing at side edges. Stitch remaining sections together at side edges and press under lower edge. Okay. This is the back casing. This is the front casing. I make a lot of my own clothes, yes, yes. Not all of them, but a lot of them. Thank you. Yeah, I believe you will. Listen, anything you put your mind to, you can do. Okay, so it's going to go front casing, back casing, and then front facing again. Everyone always tries to buy the stuff that I make for myself. <laughs> I try to tell them I have a website. I do have a website that they can shop. <laughs> Terrence Williams Designs. It's linked in my bio. <laughs> okay. So these facing... These casing pieces are together, and now I'm going to do, this will act as, they said it'll act as a lining or a facing. So 
So I'm just going to map them together. Well, thank you. I appreciate the E Rose. We are making this jumpsuit. It is No Me 2012. I think it's gonna be so cute for spring. With this daisies, it's gonna be so cute for spring. Um, I'm not sure, this is my first time making it, so I don't know how long it's gonna take. Hot Red, thank you so much for the heart me. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for the heart, me. Thank you for the team bracelet. Bethany, thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the support, y'all. I appreciate it. <laughs> thank you for the team bracelet. We're trying to hit the goal of the day. It is roses, and we're also trying to get I'm as many team bracelets as we can, so thank you. When you send a team bracelet, it helps us in the popular live ranking, so thank you. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you, Betty. I appreciate that. <laughs> We're sewing a jumpsuit. I get my patterns from Joanne Fabrics. Bethany, thank you so much for joining the team. I really appreciate it. Thank you for the heartbeat. Yay, sweetie darling. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so those sections are done. I have to attach them to the bottom. Y'all can send up to 40 team bracelets a day. 40 team bracelets a day. So thank you all for sending them. I really appreciate it. Um, I mean, I'm not, hey, Shawnee, I'm not not buying patterns. I just really haven't been excited about anything, really. Um, yeah, so I don't know. Nothing has really been like, <gasps> like, oh, my gosh, I need that, you know? But definitely on a on a uh, fabric note by. I have been sewing since 2009, 2010. So I was in college. Yeah, I was in college when I first started sewing. 
So the pattern gives you step-by-step -step instructions of how to put the garment together. So yeah. Trying to get my seams open and lined up. That's one thing I am not good at. <laughs> my seams lining up. Hey, Steve, how are you? What did I study in college? I am a political science major with a concentration in global studies. And then I have a triple minor in African studies, Asian studies, and women's studies. Steve, thank you for the heart me. I was actually going to go, I, I was actually going to college to be a lawyer. Um, Steve, have you always been level 40, Steve? Or did you just get level 40? Congratulations. Um, yeah, I was going to go to school to be a lawyer. <laughs> Esh, thank you for the roses. Esh, Esh is so petty. <laughs> Esh is so petty. Yes, we are educated. Edgy, educated. <laughs> yes, I was I wanted to do uh, international law, so I wanted to help refugees and asylum seekers seek asylum in different countries. So I was studying international law. I was gonna take the LSAT become an international lawyer. I uh, wanted to work for the UN, got into the Drexel Law School summer program, decided not to go to law school. And then, yeah, here we are. Here we are doing fashion, advocating for garment workers and human rights. So even though I'm not in the courtroom doing what I wanted to do, I still advocate um for the people that i wanted to advocate for so it all came full circle i believe and i really feel like i'm right where i need to be and if i ever wanted to go back to school i could but i was exhausted y'all i was exhausted when i tell you i worked my butt off in college <laughs> <laughs> I worked my butt off at college. I kind of wish now I would have had more fun. Um, looking back, I kind of wish I, I mean, not that I didn't have fun in college, I did, but I was very studious. I was very much about my studies. Um, and I kind of wish I would have rebelled a little more. <laughs> But I'm kind of kind of glad I didn't. <laughs> Cause Lord, Lord only knows what my life would look like. <laughs> but I wish I wish would have had just a little bit more fun, just a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> Just a tad. <laughs> I would have been a rebel. I would have been <laughs> everything under the sun, child. I listen. E everything that I am now, I would I should have been in college. <laughs> But listen, I had scholarships out the wazoo, okay? I had scholarships and financial aid. 
and I had to keep a certain GPA in order to keep that. So I was not messing around. I was not messing around. Your smile is beautiful and your laugh is infectious. Thank you. Not Javi in, in both lives. Okay, Javi, I see you. <laughs> Yes, y'all. I was like, let me let me be behaved because I'm not trying to lose all this scholarship money. <laughs> hey, Grace, how are you? For everyone who was at, saying the fabric is beautiful, I was telling you it's from Grace of Zesty Couture. She is in the building. She is in the live. Exactly. I'm doing what I love. And th again, there's nothing else that I would rather be doing. Nothing else that I would rather be doing. Well, kind of. <laughs> I kind of wish I was a stay-at-home wife to a millionaire, but... <laughs> I'll... I'll take this for now. <laughs> I will take this for now. Until that day comes. <laughs> I know we all, we all do. I'm trying to... Find a rich, a rich Brazilian man. I don't think I'm going to find him on the Tiki Tok. I do not think I'm going to find him on the Tiki Tok. <laughs> me running out of bobbin thread. You get, listen, there's a difference between getting proposed to and getting proposed to by a millionaire. <laughs> because listen, the Brazilians profess their love to me all the time, but they don't got any money. <laughs> That's why they profess their love because <laughs> they want my money. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Let me stitch. I'm almost finished. Uh, so my Bernina has this really great feature where it tells you when the bobbin is almost empty. However, there is always quite a bit a thread left. <laughs> so in most cases, I can finish whatever stitch I'm working on. But the machine will never let me. The machine will never let me. Always when I'm, yes, always when I'm close to the end is when it wants to stop. I'm just saying, y'all, there are lots of men on this app. It doesn't mean they have money. <laughs> I'm trying to find one with money. <laughs> it's what does Aretha say? Beautiful gowns. <laughs> Beautiful gowns, that's how I feel. Beautiful men, and that's... <laughs> I 
Yes, yes. It's all about the money. See, Bussan, I have, oh, yes, yes. <laughs> If you don't put on your seatbelt, all it does is make the sound. So you just put it on to stop it from beeping. Let's go back and finish this. Am I single? Yes, I am. Single and ready to mingle with a millionaire. right side of facing to wrong side of bodice at lower edge matching seams not just stitch off the face trim seams I'm calm and beautiful. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So the right sides are together. Hey, Nikki. <gasps> I think I messed up. No, I think I was supposed to do all three layers together. Where's my seam rubber?
We did talk about Usher and we talked about Beyonce. So everyone's consensus is that they enjoyed the halftime show. It wasn't their favorite. They are calling Alicia Keys, Alicia out of key. <laughs> Alicia wrong key, Alicia no keys. Um, they drag in Alicia. Hey, Myrtle, they drag in Alicia, child. They drag in Alicia. Um, we, we talked about a Beyonce a little bit. I think the consensus is people are not too enthusiastic, but they know I love Beyonce, so they're keeping it cute. <laughs> Alicia off keys, yes. Yes. People really haven't given their opinion to me about Beyonce, but that's because I think they know better. That's because I think they know better. My mailman is here. She was off key. She was off key. So there's that. I said, poor thing. Oh, solo Gemini, solo Gemini. Keep it cute. Keep it cute, beloved. <laughs> Two things I don't play about are Beyonce and Britney. Two things I don't play about are Beyonce and Britney. Keep it cute, beloved. Hey, Kizzy. <laughs> Thank you for the heart, me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tanya, thank you for the rose. I really appreciate it. Victor, welcome in. Hello, friend. I cannot believe I did that. You're going to Carnival, have fun, make good choices. All the Brazilians are at Carnival. Wow. Ain't none of them on TikTok. <laughs> they are all at Carnival.
It's so funny. The same ones saying that they have no money are the same ones who have been at Carnival every day. <laughs> How does that work? Can someone explain that to me, please? How does that work? Just like in New Year's, the same ones who said they had no money were the same ones who were on boats at, on the, boats on the beach, literally on a yacht. <laughs> Begging me for coins, but you're on a yacht. I wasn't on a yacht on New Year's Eve. <laughs> I was nowhere near a boat on New Year's Eve. I'm just saying. Hey, Julian, it's going well. I made a teeny tiny little mistake that I have to seam rip out. But aside from that, we are doing okay. What time is it? Okay. Hey, California. First time watching. Welcome in. Welcome in. In nine minutes, I have to post a video to Instagram. So... The... TikTok girlies will be paused for a second because I have to post the video when it's on my phone. But the YouTube, the YouTube people will be able to see me. <laughs> so I am on YouTube and TikTok. I'm streaming live from both. Brooklyn, New York. I have never been to Brooklyn. I've been to New York, but I've never been to Brooklyn. I've always wanted to go. I used to talk to a guy from Brooklyn, Dave from Brooklyn. He was a drummer in a band. He had a massive drumstick. <laughs> massive. Good times, I wonder how he's doing. Florida is great this time of year. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> hey, y'all. Hey, Jermaine. <laughs> I should reach, actually reach out to him. <laughs> Just to say hello. <laughs> you love my best. Thank you. Brooklyn has great restaurants. I heard Brooklyn is a vibe. I have heard Brooklyn is a vibe. Listen, I always keep it real. Listen. Y'all already know. Y'all already know me. <laughs> oh, Dave. He was so cute. My friends, they would see Dave and they would see me and they would say to me, they would be like, why are you with him? <laughs> They're like, he is not cute and i'm like yes he is you just have to get to know him like if you got like looking at him is he a little like nerdy and geeky yeah a little but like you just have to get to know him and his personality <laughs> candace thank you for the heart me i really appreciate it y'all know how it is like once you get to know someone, their personality just takes over 
uh, and they become like a hundred times cuter. That's how it was with Dave from Brooklyn. I really didn't think he was ugly. I really didn't. Even from the beginning, I didn't think he was ugly. You just had to see the vision, I guess. And my friends didn't see it, but baby. Baby. He was cute, though. His personality just made him even cuter. And the fact that he could lay down the pipe made him even cuter. <laughs> It was all just working to his benefit. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Hello. The pipe just changed things, exactly. Okay. With right pin lower casing to lower edge of bodice with right sides together. Okay. <laughs> so this will be here. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. And he was just nice. He was just a really nice guy. Just like genuinely a good guy. Ah, good times. I have looked him up, actually. <laughs> I have looked him up, um, and he seems to be doing very well for himself. He seems to be doing very, very well for himself. I'm very happy for him. I'm live on YouTube right now, so I'm streaming from both. I am streaming on YouTube and I am streaming on TikTok. I just wanna see what this looks like, okay. We are making a jumpsuit where we're attempting to. Now I'm confused. Okay. Stitch front casing sections to back casing at side edges. Okay, I did that. Stitch remaining casing sections together at side edges. I did that. And press under lower edge. And then trim. Okay. This will be used as a facing. Pin casing to lower edge of bodice with right sides together, matching seams and notches. Okay. Baste. Pin right side of facing to wrong side. Pin right side of facing to 
wrong side of bodice at the lower edge, matching seams. So I did do it right the first time. Gosh darn it. I did do it right the first time, y'all. So I seem to rip that for nothing because it was right the first time. <laughs> It's okay. Stitch all through th thickness and trim the seams. I have been sewing since 2009, 2010, and I've always just been interested in fashion. So that's how I started. I actually have a podcast. It is called Dreams, Seams, and Small Business Things. Dreams, Seams, and Small Business Things. The first episode talks about how I got started. Um my sewing journey, my small business journey, how I started my small business. So you should definitely give it a listen to get the full backstory. But yeah, I was interested in fashion and wanted to teach myself how to sew, so I did. LH, hello, hello, hello. I'm going to pin this down and then I have to post my YouTube, not YouTube, my Instagram reel. So the live is going to pause. Hello. Thank you so much for the roses. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So the live is going to pause. You'll still, uh, and I'll just, I'll be back in a minute. I just have to post this reel. You can still watch me over on YouTube. You can stick around and wait for a minute. Whatever y'all want to do. I was looking at my analytics on Instagram and my best posting time is noon 12 o'clock so i want to take advantage of it and see what happens when i post during that time thank you for following thank you thank you thank you i really appreciate it if y'all have not joined the team, make sure you join the team. Send a little heart me if you can help with the goal of the day. It is roses. It's really easy. Send a few roses. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, I did not make my vest. I got this at a thrift store. Thank you for the rose, Shani. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, spiritual mother. Okay. One more pin. Perfect. Okay. TikTok. Y'all are going to be paused for a second. Y'all are going to be paused for a second. I will be right back. YouTube. <laughs> Shawnee is in the... um. The TikTok live. 
Sean and Carmen says hello. <laughs> Thank you for the roses. Ash, um, I will be right back. Um, yeah. <laughs> Thank you all so much. I really appreciate it. 3.2K. Oh, okay. We're in the top 20%. Yay! Look at that. Thank you for the roses. Okay, I'm pausing y'all for just a second. I'll be right back. Drafts. Let's continue. Simplicity reposted me. Wow. Perfect. Okay, y'all, I'm back. What? <laughs> Let me go check the mail. Is this this? Oh my gosh. We're back. Wawak sent me their new catalog and they said I get to pick out anything that I want in it. I'm very excited. I didn't know you wanted me to tag BSN. I would have tagged that. I don't know what you want me to tag BSN in and what you don't want me to tag BSN in. I don't want to be annoying and tag them in everything. I could go back and tag you. Wawak sent their new catalog. A bunch of new stuff. I can't wait to look through and pick some stuff. Bye, Carmen. <laughs> I'll tag BSN and everything from now on. How about that? How about that? I will tag BSN and everything from now on.
Okay, we are attaching this piece again <laughs> for the second time. <laughs> I did cut all my hair off. I did. Ooh, she a little too robust this morning. Calm down now, Burnett. Calm down now. First of all, first of all, <laughs> I have said this many times, unless it's Britney or Beyonce, I really don't give a kitty who you are. <laughs> I really don't give a kitty who you are. <laughs> Someone posted in a sewing group that simplicity goes to one ninety nine on Thursday. <laughs> I do like the songs. I gave my full rundown and review on the Beyonce songs last night. I am a fan. I feel like... I don't know if it's the reflection or if I'm really seeing a fly. Y'all, I think there's a fly the size of Texas in my... <laughs> the, a fly the size of Texas in my room. <laughs> Lord. Hey, Tajri, thank you for the heart me. Bought my fabric to make a Western shirt or two. Yes, yes, we love to see it. We love to see it. I've been seeing all the People have been posting fashion inspo pics and mood boards and stuff, and I definitely have been getting a little a, a little inspired. Tajri, thank you so much for the roses. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, the casing is done. Press casing and facing down on outside. Edge stitch casing close to seam. Top stitch casing. I ain't doing all that. <laughs> I ain't doing all that. Okay, it does want me to trim though. Darkest Layer Arts, thank you so much for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Julian, I'm not top stitching shit. <laughs> I'm not doing that. I haven't done it this whole time. <laughs> you said I went over to YouTube, but you're back. Yeah, <laughs> no, I am not monetized to the point where you can gift 
on YouTube, hopefully soon, sometime this year. <laughs> hopefully sometime this year, I will be able to be monetized. And then once I'm monetized, you'll be able to gift. You'll be able to gift. But currently, right now, now, no, you can only gift on TikTok. So that's why everyone should send me a galaxy. <laughs> oh, I started adding new emotes. So if you are a... Um, subscriber if you're subscribed to my tiktok i've started adding new emotes i don't need i don't know if i can send them let me see oh yeah i can i can so this one's cute i thought i added another one This one's my favorite. It says send a galaxy. <laughs> oh, I guess I'll do this one. I guess I'll do this one top stitch. I ain't top stitching shit else. Yes! Ash, ah. <laughs> Use my emotes. Use my emotes. <sighs> Listen, you're not even going to see the top stitching. I feel like it's just for decoration anyway. It's how I feel. It's how I feel. Okay, let me move my needle over. Since the sewing gods are here, I'll do a little bit of top stitching, child. I know they're going to come for me. I'll do a little bit of top stitching for the YouTube crowd, child. Let me do some top stitching, child. Hi, Presto. Hi, Presto. How are you? I do have some announcements to make. March 2nd, I'm hosting a class. It's TikTok Live 101. So if you have ever wanted more information and more confidence about going live on TikTok, if you want to know how to monetize and make money on TikTok through going live, this is the perfect class for you. It will be March 2nd at 4 p.m. It'll be through Zoom. And it will all be all about going live on TikTok. So if you already go live, but maybe you don't have a lot of people in your lives, maybe you're not getting that many gifts, or if you've always wanted to go live, but you didn't have the confidence, this is the perfect class for you. That's the first announcement. The second announcement is March 15th. Miss Carol and I are having our first official battle. I request your presence. Thank you. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Because I need to beat her. I need to beat her. She took my dignity. She took my glory. She took my pride. And we have to win it back. We have to win it back. So thank you so much for the team bracelets. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, the date is set. That We have to figure out the time. I have to make sure my Brazilians are there. <laughs> but yes, our first official battle. Not you'll send 10 roses. I'll take it, Alexis. I will take it. Someone better, someone else better send me a lion. Shit. <sighs> Doing this top stitching. We could have been done already, but I have to do this top stitching. They wanted me to edge stitch and top stitch. They're asking for a lot. Right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the lightning ball. <laughs> Brianna, didn't you make sales on your website? So you got you have some money, 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 money. You don't have lion money yet. You don't have lion money yet. Speak it into existence. Okay. Okay. This top stitching is nice. This top stitching is nice. Okay. 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 So we have done the bodice. We have done the pockets. We have done the casing. And now we are moving on to the collar. Okay. Okay. This is cute. This is cute. Hey, Anna. Y'all. I swear to God. I swear to God. Okay, I was gonna say, I was gonna say if this shit don't fit, if this doesn't fit, but it does, it does. Okay, it's cute. Yep, yep, yep. 
Yeah. It's cute. Isn't it cute so far? Look at my little pocket. <laughs> It's nice. Isn't it nice? Yeah. Great fabric choice. Thank you. Julian helped pick me pick it out. Okay. Okay. Sincerely beaded. No, it's not from Joanne's. It's from Grace of Zesty Couture. So this is Ankara fabric from Grace of Zesty Couture. Apply fusible interface into wrong side of one color. I did that already. Piece 13. Okay. Machine stitch five eighths from notched edge of collar clip notched edges of collar to stitching on out of small dots as shown. Press under stitch facing to collar, leaving notched edges open. Okay, JK clothing, thank you. Now we're getting into the, the technical stuff. Child. I think with anything, the more you practice, the more you do it, the better you get at it. So before, I was kind of horrible with collars. Not that I'm amazing with them now, but I'm definitely a lot better with collars than what I was. Okay. Did I not notch my edges? No, my markings didn't show up. I just want to make sure that I'm doing this right.
Thank you for the rose. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me do these nachos. What time is it? Twelve thirty. Silky Slim, hello, hello, hello. We are right in the middle of the action. We are sewing Nomi 2012. It is a jumpsuit. I'm doing it in Ankara fabric. You have not missed much. High feasible. Okay. Machine stitch five eighths from notched edge of collar. Clip notch edge of collar to stitching at outer small dots as shown. Press one fourth on raw edge between clips, trim the right sides together, stitch facing to collar. I still don't get it where I'm supposed to notch it. Clip Boatage So there is this dot, there is this dot, there is this dot, there is this dot, there is this line. 
I was at this stitching line. Hopefully, that is what they mean. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, I think that looks right. So I have this one. This is the notch. I have this, this marking, this marking, the other notch, this in here. I have not had lunch yet, no. Hi, Spitfire. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Usually my lives are a lot more hectic, but it's a chill live today. <laughs> hey, Alexis. It is a chill live today for once. Please have lunch. Are you um, um, getting me tacos? <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, well, congratulations on getting the galaxy. Enjoy your lunch. Thank you for the ice cream cone. <laughs> a galaxy is a gift that you can send here on TikTok. Uh, it's my favorite gift. One of my favorite gifts. I love the castle. If anyone wants to send me a castle, I would love that. But the galaxy is like one of my favorites. <laughs> the relaxing music because I can't have anything else because it's copyrighted on YouTube and I'll get a copyright strike. So we're limited. <laughs> they were flirting hard and I was like, pay up, listen. Thank you for the galaxy. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. <laughs> 
No, literally, literally. <laughs> I deserve it. Thank you. I appreciate that. I, <laughs> I appreciate that. Thank you. Y'all didn't have to do that, but I'll take it. <laughs> I will definitely take it. Oh, they did. They beat you to it. They did. But listen, we'll we'll take another one. <laughs> I won't say no to multiple galaxies. <laughs> I will not say no to multiple galaxies. Galaxies and roses. I can't believe it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> there are dope mix. There are definitely, definitely more than one galaxy out there. <laughs> Oh, thank y'all so much. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Listen, we love a good galaxy. <laughs> thank you. I appreciate it so much. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Dope Mix. I appreciate that. We are all about good vibes and love and light and positivity here. So I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a good day, Spitfire. Thank you for stopping in. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a beautiful day out today. Okay. Collar piece. This one... Stitch collar facing, leaving notch edges open. Trim seams and corners. Okay. Have a great day. Thank you so much for the galaxy. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Y'all made my day. <laughs> if y'all have not gone to my website, Terrence Williams Designs, definitely make sure you check it out. There are tons of accessories, dusters, caftan dresses, everything there. So mm. 
leaving the notched edges open. Okay. Thank you for the heart, me. Baki, thank you, thank you, thank you. Zanita Embroidery, hello, hello, hello. I'm doing good, how are you doing? I'm making this jumpsuit. It is No Me 2012. And I'm making it in this Ankara fabric. We're working on the collar right now, which is proving to be difficult. But I'm hoping and praying I did it right. Collars are not my strong suit, so. Thank you. I think it's all about confidence. I think you can wear anything as long as you are confident. Hey, Belinda, not yours either. Listen, I just started getting really, really into menswear this year. So I'm going to get it by the end of the year, though. I'm going to get it. I didn't do a make nine board, but if I did, menswear would definitely be on it, child. Thank you for the heart, me. Hey, Atlanta, Georgia. 
Hello, hello, hello. Thank you all so much. Thank y'all so much. Oh, isn't there a new little thingy? Hold on. Yeah. I'm making a jumpsuit. Oh, you so also that's fun i chosen how are you chosen what are you doing chosen let me make sure i acknowledge chosen what do you sew everything Hello, an outside pin collar facing side to neck edge, matching centers, outer small dots, place inner small dots at shoulder seams, based both collar and facing to front neck edge as far as outer small dots, based only the collar facing section to remaining neck edge. Yes, definitely buy a sewing machine so you can learn. You will not regret it. You will not regret it. And coats. Oh, okay, okay. Blazers and jackets and coats. Oh, you're fancy. Hey, Amy. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, I heard you say last night. That is very, very impressive. Thank you for the finger heart. Sorry, y'all. I'm just, I'm very concentrated. <laughs> Put it on this collar. I just don't want to mess it up. Hello. TikTok kicked you out? Oh, no. Aren't the daisies cute? Oh, okay. Your team one, I take it. Congratulations.
I did not hear from Jay Carter and I did not reach out to him. <laughs> I did not reach out to him. Um, yeah, because that was too much. That was too much. If a, if a banana is going to happen, I want it to be because I did something myself, not because of someone else's actions. You know what I mean? He almost got, he could have got my account taken. Then we would have really been fighting. If it's something I do, then okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? That it's, that it's my own fault. But if it's something you do, oh, oh, no, we ain't having that. We are not having that. Because that was crazy. What he said was crazy. Real quick. Because that's what he is. That's how he is. That is how he is. I am making a jumpsuit. Thank you. It's cozy vibes. <laughs> cozy vibes because we really don't have a choice. <laughs> okay, I hope. I'm nervous. Yeah, these are not, these are not matching up. I know, they really do need to expand the music options because baby. <laughs> This is the center. So it's facing side to right sides together with the facing side to the shirt. It's gonna look great. Thank you. I it's I know it's gonna look great, but you still when you're trying new things and doing new things, you still get nervous. It 
always works itself out in the end, but it's just getting to that point. Oh, Olivia, thank you for subscribing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. I am definitely not a pro <laughs> at collars. Definitely not. I'm trusting, trusting the vision. Good evening. Let's hope so. The project is coming along, Tony. It's coming along. We're on the collar now. I'm making a jumpsuit. Okay. 
Hello, Maureen. Okay. The collar is on. I think I'm supposed to stitch this down. So I'm going to do that. Patricia! just placed an order Patricia thank you so much for your order I really appreciate it Thank you for the love tag. Thank you. Do you pronounce your name Ash or Ish? I've been saying Ash this whole time. But then I heard someone, I thought I heard someone say Ish the other day. Hey, Carol in New Jersey. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, it's Ish? I've been saying it wrong this whole time, child. I've been saying it wrong this whole time. I'm good. I'm well. Well, she never corrected me, so. <laughs> well, as long as you knew what I meant. Javi, I don't even want to hear it, Javi. Don't make me reveal your real name. Okay? Don't make me reveal your government name. Kayak Faith, hello, hello, hello. Okay, the collar is on. Lord Jesus, honey child. Woo! The collar is on. I'm parched. I am parched. This project has drained me. <laughs> I knew it was going to take a while. I knew it was going to take a while, child. How long have I been on live? 
almost four hours. <laughs> I knew this was going to take a while. <laughs> oh. I know. I have to eat. Hopefully, I'm almost done. <laughs> Okay. I don't think I'm almost done. Let's keep it pushing. <laughs> With right sides together and raw edges even, pin the pocket facing to the right pants. Okay. Pocket facing is piece nine to piece seven. Yes, yes, Kim. We've been on for four hours. P pocket nine to piece seven. Okay. Hello. Hey, the Crafty Hub. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you for the heart, me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I have not eaten, no. I have not. With right side, so it's the piece opposite of the crotch. I've just been so concentrated. Hi, Mateus. Not your favorite seamstress. Not your favorite seamstress. <laughs> Here he goes. Here he goes. <laughs> Here he goes. Thank you for the love tag. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That man loves me. He really does. Hey, Will. I'm good. How are you? With right sides together and raw edges even, pin the pocket facing to right pants, matching small dots. That's okay. And then I have to reinforce. I am still live. We are still here, four hours on. <laughs> so, so, what's wrong? Why are you so, so? I am, Will. I am. We are. We are making it. <laughs> Will. <laughs> we are making it. <laughs> we are definitely. Definitely making it. <laughs> Thirty K likes, yes. 
he doesn't understand any English, child. He doesn't understand any English. You have the pattern? Have you made it, Will? I can see you wearing this, Will. I can see you wearing it. You're gonna take some classes? <laughs> okay, you can, you can show me later. <laughs> Lord. Will, you're not going to make this? Oh. Everyone makes it in denim, but I didn't have enough denim to make it in denim. So here we are in Ankara making it work. We are making it work in Ankara, child. You do. You do have lots of Ankara. Turn pocket facing to inside. On outside, edge stitch front close to finish edge. They want me to edge stitch, top stitch. My God. All this edging and topping, edging and topping. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. The little V. This little open. This is why I don't do denim. This is why I don't do denim. They want you to top stitch every damn thing. I cannot believe we are four hours into this and we are going strong, y'all. Four hours in and we are going strong. Yes, four hours. <laughs> Don't judge me. I'm a slow sewist. I am a slow sewist. So. I'm good. How are you? Why'd you give me those eyes? Thank you for the rose.
you are methodical with the instructions. So it takes that. Um, that's a very nice way of putting it. <laughs> that is a very nice way. Oh, you're from Brazil. Oh, oi. <laughs> so do, babe. <laughs> Methodical is a very kind way of putting it. Shatan, I'm doing good. How are you? Okay, we're done with the first page of instructions. We are done with the first page of instructions. We are halfway through. We are on step 13 out of 26. So we're halfway. I am making this jumpsuit. Know me 2012. And then I am using this Ankara fabric from Grace of Zesty Couture. So this jumpsuit with this fabric. We have the top almost finished. Right now we are working on the pants. Um, yeah. <laughs> we are working on the pants. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, it's it's been a process so far. I'm looking fabulous. Thank you. I appreciate that. On pan inside, pin. Good afternoon, good afternoon. Okay, on inside, pin pants front side to pocket facing with right sides together, matching small dots and notches. Stitch inner curved edges together, keeping the front free. Based remaining raw edge, okay. See, I'm the type of person who has to read the instructions like 10 times in order for me to get it. So I have to take it slow, make sure I'm reading it correctly. Hello, JB. But we're making good progress, I think. I'm glad I started now or earlier. Cause baby. Thank you for the rose. Thank you, thank you, thank you.
Thank you for the likes, Anna. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My place is always so inviting. Thank you. It is relaxing. I think it's so relaxing to, because I'm so concentrated and I don't want to mess up this pattern. <laughs> I think that's one of the main reasons it's so relaxing. Um, because I'm so concentrated. <laughs> I am very concentrated. <laughs> I have not eaten lunch yet. I have not eaten lunch. I have not eaten breakfast either. play with that. I'm trying to figure it out. I hope I did it right. Stitch pants to uh, stitch pants front to pants back at inner leg. I know, they're so cute.
Okay. This pocket reminds me of the pocket that I did for Nikki's dress. It's not like a regular pocket. <laughs> I don't know the name of this type of pocket. Um, but it's like a pocket with a facing and you have to sew it in a special way. Once it's done, it looks really nice, but like the process to do it is just different. Um, yeah, it's not my favorite, but we're going to make it work. Okay, I'm almost done pinning. Is anyone else sewing today or working on anything else today? Y'all are so quiet. <laughs> y'all are so quiet today. Wow, usually I can't get y'all to be quiet. Now y'all don't want to talk. <laughs> Your cylinder machine in the damn office. Not your sleepy. You had a wild night last night, Brianna. You had a wild night. I feel like everyone is in the office. <laughs> Sierra, you're sewing. What are you sewing? What are you working on? Could it fall asleep? Mm. Mind of a ladybug, welcome in. Okay, Brianna, you said you came back. Um, when you came back into my live, you said that you didn't have a voice. You were screaming so much. That is exactly what you said. You lost your voice from all the screaming. This is the back. Left side. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You are so petty. <laughs> you each says, I'm going to be the title gifter. I'm going to be number one. <laughs> No one else is going to be better than me. <laughs> I 
Okay, I have to do the other side too. Gosh darn it. I am making a jumpsuit. I guess I have to do the other side. I was only supposed to cut one of these. Okay. Thank you for the love tag. <laughs> Thank you. This is Pant Sides Front. Thank you for helping me achieve my goal. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gosh darn it, now I think I need, I think I can do it without it. Your mom had knee surgery? I hope it went well. I hope it was successful. Did. She's rusty. Yay. We love to hear that. We love a successful surgery without any incident. Makes us very happy to hear. I have a website. It is Terrence Williams Designs. Dot com. It is the first link in my bio, and I sew and create everything on my website. You can purchase. I do everything from dusters to caftan dresses to headbands. But again, everything is on my website, Chance Williams Designs. The first link in my bio. Hey, Jay Carter. <laughs> I'm shocked to see you here. Oh, 
Okay, there's that is. Oh no, that's the piece I want. Oh no, it's this piece. I am making a jumpsuit. It is Nomi This is the jumpsuit, everyone. This is the jumpsuit. Know me 2012. I am also I'm on YouTube and I'm on TikTok. So you can watch from both. Yeah, we've been on for four and a half hours. Four and a half hours, y'all. My God. Let's set up a new goal. You're back. Good afternoon. I literally just said it's no me 2012. We're making this jumpsuit. We are making this jumpsuit. No me 2012. <laughs> hey, Susie. Okay, on the inside, inside, inside. Okay. Baste this together and then we can do to the back. Hello. Thank you.
Did I do that right? On this side? What is the question? I'm always polite. I wouldn't say that. <laughs> I would not say that. <laughs> for the confetti. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> oh, depends on who you ask. Oh, did I do something wrong? <laughs> what do I think about Taylor Swift being number one? What do you mean being number one? Always honest. Um... Yeah, I did. I mean, I am always honest. I am. Um, I just know myself and I know that I do not always have the patience and the disposition to deal with some things sometimes. <laughs> I, like every other human being, get grumpy and annoyed and feel my feelings just like everyone else. I think the difference is, hello. I think the difference is I am live and it happens publicly while other people have those moments in private or have those moments in with other people, but it's not on a public platform. Um, so I think that's what makes it different. Because when other people are like mean are short-tempered with other people. It's usually just the, in the vicinity around other people. Um, but me, when I'm annoyed and short with other people, it's literally on a live with hundreds of people watching. And so it's just a different set of eyes. Donald Trump just said some nasty things about Taylor Swift during an interview this morning. What did he say about her? There we go. I was wondering why it looked weird. Hello, good morning.
Okay. That looks a lot better. <laughs> that looks a lot better. Thank you all so much for sticking it out. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate y'all being here. Y'all do not even know. Bye, mind of a ladybug. Thanks for stopping in. Julia, Adson's girlfriend. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, Haber. Hey, Kimberly, how are you? Thank you for the heart me and joining the team. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, at the inner leg. No, same, same skincare routine. It's dropping later today. The video for my skincare routine is dropping later today. Just sleepy. Rhonda, thank you so much for the heart me. I really appreciate it. If y'all have not joined the team, make sure you join the team. Send a little heart me. I didn't watch it last night. I watched the replay. Um, it was okay. It was okay. How did you feel about it? Catherine, hello. What are your thoughts? What did you think about it? When I tell y'all, I do not really watch TV. I really do not watch TV. I was surprised he spent the a lot of the performance on the field. That's what I was surprised about. And then, yeah, I was surprised with a lot of the music selection. I definitely felt like there was a lot going on. There were so many dancers and people being shot out of cannons and like, it was a lot. There was a lot going on. And I just felt like it took away from him. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because there were just so many background dancers. It was a lot. And then... And then Alicia Keys came out, child. My 18 year old said her friends were lame and didn't know any Usher songs. Oh. Yes, Saturday was his birthday. Yes, yes, it was. Happy birthday to Adson. Happy birthday. It was his birthday.
Yeah, I'm sure it was great from the field. I'm sure. Hey, Noah. Darlene, hello. It's so good to see people's dreams and aspirations come true. It's it's really nice. It's really nice. I'm happy for him. I'm very happy for him. Pockets are in. Pant side seams are almost done. With right sides together, pin center seams matching inner leg seams and notches. Stitch center back to large dot on front. Reinforce the seam, stitch again over first stitching, clip right pants, right stitching. Okay. Yep, Stella, always hard at work. Always hard at work. I am making a jumpsuit. Hey, Dean, how are you? I am making a jumpsuit. This is the jumpsuit. It's No Me 2012. Thank you. Okay, so I'm pinning the crotch seams together. What company puts out your favorite patterns? Uh, I don't know. I like a mix of everything. McCall's and Simplicity and Know Me are at my top, but it's hard to say which one. I think Simplicity maybe. I think if I had to pick one, I'd lean towards simplicity. I'm pretty sure if I looked through all of my patterns, I would have a lot of 
a lot more simplicity. Actually, I can tell you. Because I keep track of all the patterns that I have in my collection. Yeah, the most patterns that I have are Simplicity, and then McCall's, and then Nomi, and then Vogue, and then Butterick. So I have like a, a spreadsheet, a list of all the patterns that I have. Hey, LaBelle. Um, hey, InSync. It's not necessarily a goal. No. Um, yeah, it's not necessarily a goal to have my own patterns. Have my own fabric? Yes. Have my own pattern? I mean, if the opportunity presented itself, I'm, sh I'm sure I would take it. But... I'm more interested in designing my own fabric, which I am in the process of doing. That is more exciting to me because I feel like everything has been done. You know what I mean? Like everything that we could make kind of exists already. I don't know if I could add anything new or revolutionary to the fashion scape as far as a pattern, but um, with fabric, that gets me excited. Ish, now that I'm saying it right, Ish, thank you for the finger heart. So spoon flower, so I, you can uh, design and upload your own fabric prints to Spoonflower and they will print them for you. So that is what I am in the process of doing, designing my own prints to be printed on Spoonflower. Um, yeah, I'm really excited about it. I'm really excited about it. It's just a lengthy process because I have taught myself how to do digital illustrations. So it's, <laughs> it's a process when you teach yourself, when you teach yourself anything, but I don't know, drawing, drawing art is, I feel like it's one of those things where you either have it or you don't, and I do not. <laughs> I do not, so. It's a little difficult for me having to teach myself. Spoon flower fabric is a little more on the pricey side. It is a bit more expensive, but you can get like sample cuts and samples of your fabric for really inexpensive, like swatches. They're like $5 swatches or whatever. You know what I mean? But because Spoonflower, it, everything is custom printed and because everything uh, is made to order and everything is made by designers, like graphic, uh, graphic illustrators and artists, it is a bit more expensive. But I think the quality is great. Yep, it will be available for the consumer. Yeah, I want everyone to be able to wear and rock my my stuff. Yeah. And it's great because Spoonflower offers like all kinds of fabrics. So they offer cotton and they offer jersey and they offer canvas and they offer like silky type fabrics, like everything that you could think of, like they offer. So and they also offer it on bedding and pillows and, and curtains and all of that. So all the home decor. So 
even if you're not a sewist and you still wanted my my fabric and my patterns, you could definitely still get it in like pillows and shams and bedding and, and things like that. So yeah, I want it to be a little a little enterprise. <laughs> Okay. Stitch front to back at side and edges. I mean, I literally was growing my hair out and I just shaved it like two days ago. So. Thank you. It is from Zesty Couture. She does, she sells Ankara fabric. Yes, you definitely should. You definitely should. Yes. Yeah, so I have ideas and things in my mind, but do I have the artistic ability to make it work? Absolutely not. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> but we're going to try. We are going to try. <laughs> That's all you can do, I feel. That is all you can do, I feel. This is on the outside. This is on the outside. Okay. Love the fabric you have now. Thank you. Yes. If you're looking for really good Ankara fabric, this is from Grace of Zesty Couture. She has her own website. She has, she does have a, her own store inside of her house. You do have to schedule an appointment to go in to see her. But if you're in the Dallas, Texas area, you can definitely visit her.
It's so soothing. Everyone keeps saying that. <laughs> Everyone keeps saying how soothing it is. <laughs> I don't know if this is right. Yes, so everything that you have is yours and original and no one else is going to have it, exactly. I don't think it's supposed to look like that. Yeah, so this is the Burnett to B79. It is a sewing and embroidery machine. It is computerized. It has the automatic knee lift, which uh, comes on a lot of Burnett and Bernina models. Um, I really love this machine. Again, it is both sewing and embroidery. It has a bunch of different attachments on it. So you can take this piece off and just have the arm or you can switch it out and there's a full big long table. It has a bunch of really cool stitches and features. Um, I would definitely, if you're looking for a good sewing machine, I would definitely look into this one. And again, it is the Burnett B79. If you're not interested in embroidery, they do have the B77. And it's essentially the same without the embroidery compartment. Or embroidery attachments. I am making a jumpsuit but I'm a little stuck. I don't know what I did wrong.
No problem. No problem. What's also really nice about this machine is uh, it has a touch screen on it. And if you're ever confused or you're not show, sure what to do, it gives you like step-by-step -step instructions. And it also has a sensor that tells you when your bobbin is about to run out, which is really helpful. Hey, relax. I'm missing my gifts, so I'm so concentrated. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm very concentrated. <laughs> if I miss stuff, I'm sorry. I'm just focused. I am focused. Try not to mess up these pants. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Okay. I got it. Hey, K Bella. Um, yeah, y'all know me. I am a double, triple, quadruple checker. So for me, I have to read the instructions 10, 20, 30 times <laughs> before it clicks, before I get it. And I'm also the type of person who has to visually see it working. Like if I am doing, like I'm doing a pocket now, I can't just put the pieces together and not see a pocket. Like I have to know that it's gonna form into a pocket, but I think I'm getting better at trusting the process and trusting the fact that doing all of these steps is actually going to form what it is that it's supposed to form. And I think that just has to do with confidence. I just have to be more confident in what I'm doing and knowing that it's going, that I'm doing it right. Because now, I mean, it's coming together really well. Like really, really well. No, listen, <laughs> I don't care what anyone says about me being slow and having to read the instructions a million times. I want to make sure that I'm doing it right. And so I would rather be slow and make sure that I'm doing it right than to act like I know and mess it up along the way. So for me, it's just important to slow down and take those extra steps. I will say I am getting better though, because before I would make a pattern and make it again and I would need the instructions. Like I would have to have the instructions out. I would have to read them over and over and over. Like it was the first time that I saw the pattern, but now I've gotten to a place where I'm like, okay, 
I'll have the instructions to the side, but I don't necessarily need them. I don't need to be pouring over them and stressing. You know what I mean? I can just like if if I get, if I forget a step or if I get distracted, I can just look and I'll be okay. Hey Lisa, thank you. I hope you're having an amazing day too. Okay, so this I can confidently sew all the way down. Because sewing is one of those things, it's like makeup. Sewing is kind of like makeup, where specifically, like, if you're doing an eyeshadow look, I don't know if any of you are into makeup. Thank you, Lisa. I don't know if any of you are into makeup or into doing your eyeshadow, but when you first start to build your eyeshadow look, it looks crazy. Alphabet Junkie, thank you for the love tag. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, thank you for helping me complete my goal. Thank you. When you start to build your eyeshadow look, it, you look absolutely insane. Until it, uh, you get to the end and then you add the lashes. But when you start to build out that inner, that inner corner and then you go in with the crease and then the blending shades and then... You know, if you're going to do a cut crease or if you're going to do an inner corner, all the little steps, um, it doesn't come together until the end. That's how sewing is. So you just have to trust the process. Definitely trust the process. Lisa, thank you so much for the heart me. Alphabet Junkie, thank you so much for the love tags. Nice to see you back. Sorry about before. <laughs> Confirm. Okay, new goal. Thank you, thank you, thank you all so much for the love. I really appreciate it. How long have we been on live? Five hours. We've been here for five hours, y'all. Oh, thank you. One pant leg is done. Okay, one side is done. Now I'm doing the other. I think the most nerve wracking thing, someone asked if I was gonna try it on, yes. So I always, I always try 
my stuff on at the end so I can show y'all. Um, but I think that is one of the most nerve wracking things as a sewist is when you get to the end and you have to try everything on. <laughs> that is truly the moment of truth. <laughs> Truly, uh, did I do everything correctly? Um, did everything work? Hey, Miss Maddie. Yeah, we love pockets. We love pockets. I keep thinking about the um, McCall's jumpsuit that I did the other day. I think I'm going to make it again. Add pockets and keep the deep V. Remove the placket. I, I keep having dreams about that jumpsuit. <laughs> so I'm like, I need to make it again, but I need to make it my way. The way that I like it. Because it definitely has potential. But yes, I think the most nerve-wracking part is putting it on because you just spent hours and hours and all this time and effort and you put it on just to see that it fits or doesn't fit or this is wrong or this is upside down or this isn't right and it's enough to make you want to quit so we <laughs> I think we have all been there where we got to either the end or the middle point of a project and we tried it on or we looked at it and we were like, and we say to ourselves, this doesn't look right. And then we realize we sewed the, the front to the front or the, the front to the back, or we sewed the pant legs wrong, or we sewed something upside down and we sewed something inside out. And it may be, let me tell you the, especially when you're just starting out, you do not know how many times I have thrown fabric across the room and didn't sew for a week or two or more because I was so mad at myself. So mad at myself. It's been there. Yeah, we've all been there. We have all been there. Not a good feeling, but you know what? We overcome. We overcome and we try again and do our best. Okay, so I'm doing the other pant leg. Been there, done that. See, we've all been there. We have all been there. All my moments, welcome in. Why not creations? Welcome in. Hello, hello, hello. is going on with TikTok shop. I'm tired of it. I am tired. Um, man. All the hoops they are making us jump through, all the new rules and all the work we have to do just to not get any views or sales and it's just exhausting. It's just really exhausting. Turn up facing on inside of bodice with right sides together and raw edges even. Pin upper edge of pants to lower edge of casing. Okay. 
Let me see. Wow, y'all. Okay. Okay. Crochet is a little more forgiving. So we have the pants, the pockets, pocket here, pocket here, and then we have the two back pockets here and here. Hey, Donetta, I am making this uh, Nomi 2012 boiler suit, jumpsuit with Ankara fabric. So the pants, they're not done, but they are together. So now the next step is attaching the pants to the top. And then this is the top. So we're gonna attach the pants to the top and then we're gonna get into the facing and the zipper and then all the finishing touches. So we are on step 17. Step 17 of 26. Oh, yes, all morning. So I've been on live for five hours and 18 minutes. Let me take a little water break. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I was parched. Okay. To the pants. I do have a small business. It is called Terrence Williams Designs. I have a website. It is the first link in my bio. I make ethically sourced and sustainably produced clothing and accessories. Everything is genderless and size inclusive. So you enter in your sizing information and then I make everything custom for you. Um, again, Terrence Williams Designs, it is the first link in my bio. <laughs> Anna, I was like, ha, 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 Anna. hey, Anna, I was trying to say, hey, Anna, and it wouldn't come out. <laughs> it would not come out. <laughs>
Anna, you can come in and out as many times as you want to. <laughs> I have been on here for five hours. I do not expect you to stay for all five hours. I don't have any snacks. I don't. I actually, I do. I do. I forgot. I have my fruit bars over there. <laughs> Turn up facing on inside of bodice. Okay. Oh, yes. Yeah, I, uh, again, all my clothes are genderless and size inclusive, so they are made for everyone. Every boy, girl, he, him, they, them, everyone. They are made for everyone because clothing is just clothing and it shouldn't have a gender and you should be able to wear whatever it is that you want to wear. So that's how I live my life and I allow other people to live their life that way too. <sighs> you should you can definitely learn hey spiritual mother with right sides together and raw edges even pin upper edge of pants to the lower edge of the casing i'm a beautiful soul i try to be Lord knows I'm not perfect, but I try to be as nice as I can. <laughs> yes, for all humans, yes. Okay, let me read this. With right sides together and raw edges even. Pin the upper edge of the pants to the lower edge of the casing. I have an awesome smile. Thank you. With right sides together and raw edges even. Okay. I'm 5'3 with a 44 chest and a zero hips, trying to make curves with clothes. Listen, it just takes a little bit of, a little bit of finessing. <laughs> You know what I mean? You can belt it. You can do something, you know? <laughs> we can make it work. Loves your positivity, viewpoints, radiant beauty in every way. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Listen, we only have one, one life to live, so they say. I don't know. I hope, I hope reincarnation exists. <laughs> I would have do some things over. <laughs> but they say we only have one life to live. So I'm trying to make this the best, happiest life that I can make it. I was watching this YouTube video yesterday. I don't know how I get on these videos, but it was all about space. And it was all about us in the universe. And when you really stop to look at it, the universe is massive. 
we are just a tiny, tiny, tiny little speck, a little dot in the in the massive universe. And it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger and expanding. And there are parts of it that we haven't even we don't even know anything about. Even parts of our galaxy that we don't know anything about. So when you stop to think about it, when you stop to think about just how massive everything is, it it puts into perspective just how minuscule certain things are, you know? So that's just how I try to put things into perspective. The, doesn't it, it doesn't work all the time, child. <laughs> it does not work all the time because I'd be getting mad at some petty stuff. But <laughs> hey, Dijanae, I am sewing Norris's pattern. I am sewing Nomi 2012, and I'm using this Ankara fabric from Grace, this beautiful floral Ankara. So yeah, that's what I'm, that, this is what I'm working on today. Exactly, exactly. And tomorrow is never guaranteed. You never know what could happen. We could be here today and gone tomorrow. So... Again, I just try to make the best with what I've got. Just try to make the best with what I've got. Yes, yes. I hope you've lived a beautiful, fulfilled, happy life. I hope it was great. I hope it is great. All you can do is live life and be happy. Do things that make you happy. Hey, Nikki. Yes, yes, I'm in that stage of my life too. I am in that same stage because I spent so much time and not that I regret all of it, but I spent so much time putting other people, especially recently, putting other people before myself. And now I'm in a stage of my life where I want to put myself first. And I want pe other people to put me first. I think I've done so much that I deserve it. <laughs> hey, Mama S, JK Clothy, it's the absolute truth. It is. It really is. I've done so much for other people and oh yes i'm tired <laughs> i'm ready for people to do stuff for me oh yes this is coming out so nice
So that's going to form a channel. Yes. I look beautiful, thank you. Turn up facing on inside a bodice with right sides together. Round just pin upper edge of pants to the lower edge. Matching seams and matches stitch. Okay. Thank you for following. Okay. I am making a jumpsuit. Okay, I'm gonna stitch these together. We're doing good. <laughs> Everyone's really excited. Everyone is really excited. <laughs>
is one of those. What do I mean by ethically sourced fabric? If you go to, I mean, I'll explain it, but there's a whole um, part of my website that it goes into all my sustainability practices, but I use mainly dead stock fabric. So that's one way that it is ethically sourced. I also only use fabric from suppliers where people who make the fabric work in safe working conditions or paid fair wages. Um, I also use a lot of like tensile lyocell, um, fabrics that are printed in the United States with only a thimble of water. Um, that's what I mean by ethically sourced fabrics. Um, it depends on where I source the fabric from. If it's dead stock, no, because it's dead stock. Uh, but if it's from like spoon flower, where everything is custom printed and printed on demand uh, with low water waste, then yes. Trim seams, press seams towards casing, press facing down over casing on inside, pin, press edges of facing seams. Okay. Love the daisies, thank you. Spoon flour is expensive, but the reason spoon flour is expensive is because they do things so sustainably. So instead of using gallons and gallons and gallons of water with their cotton production, they only use like a thimble. Um, it's also really expensive because everything is designed by artists and graphic designers. So they pay them a percentage. Um, and this stuff is printed right here in the United States and it's printed on demand. So there, it's not like they have a bunch of fabric in inventory. It's all basically blank and then it's printed on demand whenever someone orders something. So definitely, definitely on the pricier side, but you're paying for those sustainability benefits and you're also helping artists get paid a commission in a kind of fair wage so and the quality of the fabric is really nice
I'm attaching the pants to the top and I'm making the casing for the elastic in the center. We are on step 17 of 26. And the 26th step is literally just um, hemming the edge. So, I mean, it counts, but it doesn't really count. <laughs> Okay. Thank you. Yeah, I'm excited for this to be finished. Yes, definitely trying to be part of the solution and not the problem, yes. I know, I love this fabric. Love, love, love this fabric. Okay, now it wants to be difficult. Thank you. Listen, we're trying to branch out and and be on different different platforms and monetize on different platforms. So, yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying on YouTube. <laughs> it's definitely slow but steady wins the race over here. But I think today's live will help a lot. Time is it three o'clock? Oh. Huh. 
Hi, Kayo. <laughs> Thank you, Kaya, for the heart me. Rhonda, thank you so much for the team bracelet. Thank you for the heart me. One moment, one moment. <laughs> One moment, one moment. <laughs> Hi, Fernando. Thank you for the heart, me. Here come all the Brazilians. Here come all the Brazilians. I'm good, how are you? Angela, I am making a jumpsuit. I am making this jumpsuit, Know Me 2012. And I'm doing it in a Ankara print fabric. I'm attaching the top, the top to the bottom has been attached. I am doing the channel for the elastic currently. We are a little over halfway done. We have been on for almost six hours. <laughs> I am breathing. I am. <laughs> we have been on here for almost six hours trying to get this done. I think once it's finished, it's going to be really cute. And obviously, I'll try it on for you. April Ariana, welcome in, welcome in. That's pinned into place. So now it wants me to go to the outside. If I can find the outside. Here we go. And top stitch. So that's what we are going to do. We are going to top stitch. Is anyone out sewing today or working on anything? Ah. <sighs> 
you're cutting pieces for a, a bear. You're going to a pattern making class. That's exciting. Oh, you're kidding me. No. Let me double check just to make sure. Headed home from work. We love that. I think I sewed the wrong sides together. Yeah, I did. Thing I checked. I see what I did. I see what I did. I pinned the wrong sides together because the facing, so when I did the facing and the case, when I did the part for the casing, it's right sides together. So when I did right sides together, I did it for the casing and not for the top of the jumpsuit. So I just have to go through and seam with it. And flip it. <laughs> thank you so much for the high bear. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're working on curtains, that's exciting.
I am working on a jumpsuit. We have been smiling and laughing all day, Tracy. I am working and concentrated. Hey, Megan, how are you? Okay, this is the right side. Hey, Pamela, how's New York today? Well, there's that. <laughs> there is that. Okay, right sides are together now. <laughs> Y'all are supposed to get a snowstorm? Oh, no. Hey, Julian. Thank you for the heart, me, Trish. Thank you, thank you, thank you. They closed the schools already? Wow. They're getting ready for it. Are you in New York State or New York City? Mm. 
New York City, Staten Island. Oh. Welcome back, spiritual mother. Welcome back. Welcome back. TikTok keeps booting you out. I wonder why. Not the forgotten borough. Not the forgotten borough. I used to talk to a guy from Staten Island, Charlie. Charlie from Staten Island. I am making this a uh, jumpsuit. Know me 2012. This is the jumpsuit I'm making. I'm attaching, I've attached the, the bottom and the top. In the center, there is a channel for elastic. So that's what I'm working on. The elastic channel. It's giving me a little bit of trouble. So I'm just very concentrated <laughs> because I've been doing this for six hours now working on this. So <laughs> I am ready to at least get to a point where I can put it on and feel good about it, but we're not quite there yet. Not quite there yet. Okay. Hello, hello. Thank you. This fabric is from Grace of Zesty Couture. It is Ankara. Okay, there we go. There we go. Perfect. Mm. Okay. Thank you. 
Let's try this again. <laughs> It's good. The weather's really pretty today. I haven't been outside at all today. I've been working on this jumpsuit. We are six hours. Yeah, six hours into this jumpsuit. So. <laughs> it has been a testament to patience. It's actually, it, it's not difficult. It's not difficult. I'm just slow. <laughs> it's not difficult. I'm just slow. I would definitely make it again, though. Well, I say that now. I have to wait till I try it on to see what it looks like. Six hours. But I am determined to finish this. I know it's going to be gorgeous. I'm making this jumpsuit. Know Me 2012. <laughs> that perfection. This is stumbling, stumbling down the road of trying to get it finished. No, I'm kidding. It's uh the process has not been that bad. The process has definitely not been that bad. I've definitely done more difficult patterns. Again, I'm just slow. But now, now that I see it coming together, I'm getting a little more. Not that I wasn't excited, but I'm just getting more excited. Okay. Listen, it's because I pick good patterns and good fabric. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I pick good patterns and good fabric. The inside of this is tore up. My God. Let's do a little zigzag stitch for this frame. A little zigzag. So to prevent further fraying and it coming apart, I'm just zigzagging the edges. You can surge if you want, or you can do a zigzag. And so because I'm just on my sewing machine, I'm just gonna do a zigzag really quickly. Okay now. <laughs> okay now. Have a 
Happy Mardi Gras. Are you celebrating? Okay, so now I'm going to fold this casing piece down on the inside and pin it and then sew a straight stitch over to form the casing. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. This time it's right. Ouch. Gustavo, thank you for the heart me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, the fabric is not hard to work with. It is Ankara, so it's just a cotton. So it's definitely not hard to work with. I actually love working with wovens. Hey, Haber. I love, love, love working with wovens. They're not as forgiving as knits. Uh, but I do like working with them. I'm good, how are you? Are you feeling better today? Thank God all that's going to be like inside. Ooh, I'm nervous. Hey, April, how are you? I think I am fine. Oh, Lord. I love working with Viscose Shally. I love, that's probably my new favorite fabric. How do I get the Medesi tote pattern for the sew along? Is it in the BSM bio? Always beautiful, thank you. Uh, I don't know, Nikki or Carmen should have it. I don't know anything about it. If you go to Carmen's profile or Nikki's profile um, and click the BSN link, Carmen usually links everything there. Is it for Nikki's bag girly? Hey, Nylon, bag girly brunch.
yeah if then you can go to carmen's profile click the link for the bsn calendar and you should go to um nikki's bad girly brunch and it should be there um i don't know anything about it this is the first time hearing it but if you all the links are usually on Carmen's profile on the BSN calendar. Yes, a lot of work. Always a lot of work. <laughs> Thank you, the Amazon. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. My laugh cheers you up. Well, I'm glad my laugh can cheer you up. <laughs> it's doing its job. <laughs> okay, we are almost. We are almost there. Oh, I was like, what is that? Z pocket. You're welcome. I'm smiling because I am almost at the end of this. <laughs> I don't, I do not wash my fabric before using it. I am working on a jumpsuit. I'm working on this jumpsuit. Know Me 2012. And I'm using this Ankara fabric to make it. I am currently working on the channel for the elastic to go through. Thank you. Okay, I have to concentrate, so I'll be back. <laughs> I have to do a, oh my gosh, not my thread coming out. I have to do a straight line. <laughs> <laughs> and if you know me, I cannot sew in a straight line. So <laughs> this is going to be a problem. <laughs> Wish me luck. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, let me slow it down. Let me slow it down. Have I spent a lot of time on live? Yes, I've been on for six hours and 22 minutes. Six hours and 22 minutes. Oh, you're kidding me. I am. I am very dedicated. <laughs> very dedicated or foolish. I don't know which one.
Hey, hey. Thank you for the heart puffs, Haber. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome back, mind of a ladybug. Hey, Carrie, how are you? Yeah, it's coming along really nice. It's coming along really nice. We are... We have a few finishing touches, uh, but I'm happy with everything so far. You know what? I wasn't prepared. How is your uh, hip feeling now? gosh I don't know why it keeps stalling like that it's really weird okay yeah no feeling in your right leg. That's not good. That is not good at all. Okay. Cut a piece of elastic the length of the elastic guide thread, elastic through opening ends of casing, stitch in place along seam line securely. Okay. How big of a piece of elastic do I need? 118 inch zipper. Oof. One inch wide elastic. Hello, 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 hello. Let me see if I have one inch wide of off. Oh, no, y'all. I don't know. Okay, hold on. What did I do with my big thing? Oh, here it is. Listen, I'm trying to finish as quickly as I can. I'm ready to be finished. <laughs> I 
I do not have one inch elastic. <laughs> thank you, Katrina. Haber, thank you for the heart puffs. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Haber, you better save your money. Um, my sister and I are not speaking, so I'm not sure how she is doing. It's okay. Um, she has been through a very traumatic difficult situation and she's processing it the way that she feels she needs to process it and that involves not speaking to anyone so that is <laughs> that is her not 50 coins that is her way of of dealing with it i guess and it is what it is. Nothing I can really do about it. Thank you. Yes, I pray that it does get better and she finds whatever it is that she is looking for. And I hope that she knows we love and support her. Um, yeah, that's just what I hope for her. That's all I can hope for her. I cut my piece of elastic. I'm going to feed it through. Hey, Tajri. <laughs> thank you for the heart puffs, Haber. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh. I pray. Okay. Carrie, thank you so much for the love tag. I really appreciate it. Thank you. It's coming along good. I'm about to feed the elastic through. And then I might be at a point where I can try it on. So after I feed the elastic through, I just have to do... Why not creations? Thank you so much for the love tag. I appreciate it. I have to add the zipper and the facing. Yeah, that's it. The zipper and the facing. I say that's it, but the zipper and the facing is like a <laughs> an integral part of the whole Haber. Welcome back. Oh my gosh. Thank you for the heart puffs. <laughs> it's the la the last few steps are kind of important. Hey Brandy, how are you? Okay. 
Okay, I'm feeding it through. I'm good, just working on this jumpsuit, trying to finish. Okay, I thought this might be a little too wide. Listen, this is the only elastic I got. And I thought it might be a little too wide, but it's... I need to fix my hat. It'll be okay, friend. It'll be okay. Which spicy conversation? Which one? <laughs> Listen, spicy conversations on my live are a regular thing. They are a common occurrence. <laughs> my Lord. Not this kind of unplugged. What will you change it to? What are you going to change your picture to? Oh, gosh. Now it's getting bunched up. We're back on track. I will post the suit on my Instagram and on my website so you'll be able to see a picture. Okay, the elastic is almost all the way through. Hi, Chef Dale. Yes, you went back. It's a nice picture. I am making a jumpsuit. I'm good. I'm good. I'm just trying to finish this. I do not like elastic, I will be honest. It's not my favorite to work with.
Okay. I think that's all I'm going to get. I'm going to try it on. So this is what we have so far. The pants attached to the top. I am going to step off camera and I'm going to try it on really quickly. Just for a fit check, specifically with the elastic. Oh my gosh. Okay, y'all. Okay. Have fun at the market with your father. This is what we have so far. It's a nice fit. It is, and it has pockets. Thank you for the heart puff. Isn't it cute? I have to keep it closed. <laughs> I would be just seeing my drawers. But yeah, it's cute. It's really cute so far. <laughs> I do make clothes for other people. I actually have my own website, Terrence Williams Designs. It's linked in my bio. However, thank you for all the heart puffs. Thank you. <laughs> So yeah, this is a good, a good fit. Hold on. I don't want to expose all the goods. I want to see if I can pull more of the elastic through. Okay. Yeah. It's cute. It's really cute. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for the finger heart. Thank you. Yeah, now you have to make it. Now you have to make it. <laughs> okay, again, I still have to close up the front. I have to do the, the facing and the collar um, and add the zipper, but it looks good so far. So I'm going to change back and we're gonna get as much done. Um. <laughs> I, um, I'm gonna change, change back because <laughs> everything's falling out of this child, everything. <laughs> It's cute though. It is 
cute. Ah, <sighs> okay. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, my little socky's back on. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey, Julian. Hey, Presto. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I have to sew the elastic in place. So I'm just doing that right now. Or attempting to. Mm, my stomach is growling. <laughs>
here comes the part I am not sure about. Understitch the lower facing. Turn the left lower facing to inside press. Oh, I missed this. Oh, I missed. Child, I missed. <laughs> I was like, those instructions don't make any sense, but I missed like 10 steps. Okay. Hello. Apply feasible interfacing to wrong side of upper facing. Did that. <clears throat> Finish unnotched edge of left upper facing. So the side with the pocket. Yeah, I did that. Finish unnotched edge of upper. Oh, hey, Coco. No, I've never created jeans. Yes, the jumpsuit is coming along. We're almost finished. Finish unnotched edge of upper left facing. Press under lower edge along seam line. Oh, I see what it's saying. I see what it's saying. Thank you, Sunny, for the love tag. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I see what it's saying. I got it, I got it. Okay. There could have been an easier way for them to say that. <laughs> there could have been an easier way for them to say that.
Okay. I'm not adding buttons. So I'm just going to pin this. 50K what? 50K likes? We are at 47. If you're talking about likes, we're at 47. I think I have to roll this up. Yeah, roll this up. Pin it like this. Yeah, I w I'm at 47.9. Hey, Susie. is on. Now I'm going to apply the lower facing. Oh my gosh. Is this the lower facing? Yes. With right sides together and raw edges even, pin left lower facing to jumpsuit front. Matching small dots, large dots, and notches. Stitch from upper edge to large dot. Back stitch at dot to reinforce the seam. Okay. Hi, forever. Okay. <laughs> Listen, that's why I go so slow and have to read the instructions 10 times because sometimes it just not make any sense. Hi, Wood, how are you? It is like speaking in hieroglyphics or something. Okay, I am going to sew this down.
It's so combi. It is. Today it is. <laughs> Usually it's chaos. Open out lower facing. Pin close facing down onto left lower facing between the small dots. Based zipper. Stitch zipper. Okay. Oh, open out the lower. See, their terminology is so weird. Hey, Pat. So open out the lower facing, meaning bring it out. Pin closed zipper face down. So I have to find a zipper. An 18 inch zipper. Twelve, seven, nine, twelve. Thank you. I don't have an 18 inch zipper, y'all. Monday is treating me good. It's treating me really good. I'm just going to do the other side. I'm going to do everything but the zipper. Because I don't have a zipper long enough, so...
I am making a jumpsuit. Thank you. Okay, so I'm doing the right side now. So I did the left side. I'm doing the right side, attaching the facing. Brittany, thank you so much for the love tag. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm trying to think what I can put in Is the top piece of the facing on now I'm going to do the bottom piece of the facing both of these have interfacing I prepped that last night if you were on live with me last night <laughs> um, you saw me prepping everything and getting everything ready for today Thank you for following. Is a zipper hard to put? I, listen, I'm not good at zippers. This one seems easy, but yeah, I am not good with zippers just because I don't have enough practice with them. It's not something that I commonly use. So, Genuinely, I don't think they're too, too difficult. Like I put zippers in zipper pouches, like I've done purses uh, and that's easy for me. I have that down to a science now. Um, Cause I'll do zipper, again, zipper pouches and little purses. Those zippers I can do. Zippers in clothing, child. I just need to practice a little more, I think. <laughs> a positive and soothing energy. Thank you. I try. We are all about good vibes and positivity here. So I definitely do try. Do not always succeed, but I try. <laughs> Thank you. 
I taught myself how to sew. Uh, my sister got me a sewing machine and I taught myself how to sew and went from there. Um, I do have a podcast. It's called Dreams, Seams, and Small Business Things. The first episode talks about the whole process of how I got started, my inspiration, all of that good stuff. Again, it's called Dreams, Seams, and Small Business Things. You can listen to it on basically every um, everywhere you can listen to a podcast. If you want the full story. Thank you. I came up with it myself. Okay, so these two pieces get sewn together and then this piece gets sewn down. Yeah. I wish I had, oh, I guess it's fine. Thank you. This headband is available on my website, Terrence Williams Designs. Uh, I make and sell them myself. It's the first link in my bio. This one is the pink velvet. So it is a pink velvet. What's nice about these ones is you can pull them down over your ears and they become ear warmers. Um, but yet they have an adjustable knot in the front so you can make them bigger or smaller to fit any head size. And this one is in stock. It is available on my website. Still going. It's going good, Miss Carol and Bubble Bath. It's going good. I'm applying the facing. The only issue I have is I don't have an 18 inch zipper. So I'm doing everything but the zipper. And then we'll go from there. Okay, so then this will be flipped to the inside. <laughs> I am. I'm very, very hardworking. Very hardworking. Very determined. 
<laughs> Under stitch to the right lower facing with right sides together. Pin facing to neck edge. With right sides together, pin facing to neck edge. I know, I know, I cannot wait. I cannot wait to go back and get those fabrics. I am so, so excited. I know, I know. You should have seen me in school, in the store. I was freaking out. I was like, oh my gosh, yes, 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 yes. Yes, absolutely, yes, a hundred times. I just wanna see what this looks like. Okay, so I'm pinning this to the collar. Thank you for the heart puff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so what I would do is sew this down and then flip it like this, and these would be out. And then this would be on the inside with the zipper. Mm. 
Okay. I'm going to do, because I might need to take this out. So I'm going to elongate my stitch and basically just put a temporary stitch here until I'm really ready to commit. Because <laughs> I might have to take it out because of the zipper, I'm not sure. But I want to see what everything looks like, even without the zipper. Because curiosity. <laughs> because I've come this far and I don't want to wait any longer. So this might be one of the last things that I do. Hey, Levette, how are you? And maybe we can finish this on another day when I get the zipper. This flips out. Thank you. I'm doing good. How are you? Good night. Oh my God, not me poking a hole in the freaking fabric. Are you kidding me? Anthony, I'm good. How are you? That's good. And then this will be folded to the inside. And then this will be like folded down. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna try it on. Probably gonna need some pins. No, that is a um, pink lomain. Thank you for following. Okay, I'm gonna try this on. The front is gonna be open, so I need some pins to pin it closed. <laughs> I'm almost done. I don't have a zipper, so I can't put in the zipper, but everything else is basically almost done. So I'm gonna try it on so y'all can see what I have so far. Okay, I'll be right back.
Okay, so it's not, <laughs> not getting food and water. It's not going to look to this. It's not going to look this bunched up in the front. Once I add the zipper, um, but this is what we have. This is what we have so far. So I, again, I still have to do the zipper. But uh, basically, everything else is finished. Um, yeah, and the hemming, I just have to hem the sleeves in the bottom. But this is it, y'all. Look, my waist is snatched. My waist is snatched. Ah. Ah. Thank you so much for the love tag. Thank you. Isn't it cute? It's really cute. It came out came out so good. The sleeves should not have been three four. I don't wear three four sleeves, so if you make it, you can make it three four sleeves, but never would I ever. <laughs> okay, <laughs> we're either doing a short sleeve or we're doing long sleeve. I don't do three fours, so. <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying to make sure my goodies don't fall out because I just got it safety pinned. But um, yes, yes, this is it. This is it. Mine is a little more fitted than Norris's because I like my jumpsuits to be fitted. So I did the smallest size. Um, no, I'm not selling them. I'm making them for myself. <laughs> um. Yeah, I did the smallest size, which is a 34, because I wanted it to be fitted, a little more fitted. His is a, a little a little baggy. Um, yeah, because I don't really do baggy, but yeah, this is this is what it looks like with the back pockets. Again, I still have to thank you. I asked everyone last night what fabric I should use. Um, and Julian and Co. So I, when I touched this one, I was like, this is it. This is it. I have a feeling. But I wanted to ask everyone. And this is the overwhelming, resounding yes, yes, yes. I got this fabric from Grace of Zesty Couture. She sells Ankara fabric. She also does custom commissions. Uh, Zesty Couture is the name of the business. She has an online store. And if you live in Dallas, you can schedule an appointment uh, to look at the fabric in person. But 
yeah, once I put the zipper in and finish the collar, it's done. It is, it's done. I think it's really cute. It's gonna be so good for spring. It's gonna be a cute spring piece. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look to see. I have to read the instructions one more time, Carmen, to see the about the facing and if I, cause y'all know I love a good button. Y'all know I love a good button. <laughs> So if I could do um <laughs> if I could do a, a button over a zipper, I will any day. <laughs> so yeah, I just have to look one more time. Thank you for the roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It, it came, I'm like, it came out really nice. It like it came out really nice. Okay, so here are my here are my thoughts. Here are my thoughts. This pattern is at the level of average. I would agree. It definitely is an average skill set pattern. However, I think anyone can make it. It really. Yeah, it really isn't that difficult. It really isn't that difficult to make because truly it's just a, a, it's a shirt with a collar and pants and that's basically it. And you're just combining them together. I think the only tricky thing that people might have is with the um the facing maybe a little bit um, and the zipper if you're not used to a zipper which i'm not but thank you angela thank you sabs thank you thank you thank you aside from that i would um i would definitely make this again a hundred percent i would a hundred percent make this again i wouldn't make any changes or alterations to it um yeah, I really like this pattern. It might take other people a, a slower time. I mean, a, a quicker time. I, listen, I'm I'm Shelly the snail when it comes to sewing. <laughs> I have to read the instructions 10, 10 times to make sure that I'm reading it correctly, that I'm doing it right. So other people might be able to get it done quicker. It took me... Uh, seven and a half hours. It took me seven and a half hours to do the jumpsuit. But again, I'm really slow. I'm really slow. But I think it was worth it when I make it again. Hey, Angel. Hey, Cheryl. Uh, when I make it again, I'll definitely use my serger. For this first time, I wanted to use my sewing machine just in case I made any mistakes. And I'm glad I used my sewing machine because I did make a few mistakes. And if I would have used my serger, it would have just been a disaster. I probably would have had a meltdown on live, y'all. <laughs> but it is a sewing pattern that you can easily use your serger or your sewing machine. Um, yeah, I'll definitely be making it again. It's really nice in Ankara. Really nice in Ankara. I know everyone is saying they want to make it in denim. Once my no buy is over, I will probably make it in denim. Um, I saw a few people online make this in denim and it looked really cool. And then Will just mentioned it. But yeah, any type of like, any type of um, denim or Ankara. I'm wondering maybe even if we I did it kind of like in a silky material. Maybe. You know what I mean? Like kind of like like a sleepwear jumpsuit. You know what I mean? Do y'all see the vision or no? Is that too much? I don't know. I love the Ankara though. I love the Ankara. 
like this is yeah yeah i'm glad that i took the time because carmen and i were talking carmen was bugging and bugging and bugging me and she was like what pattern are you gonna do what pattern are you gonna do and i was like i don't know i don't know um and when i mentioned this one and she was like yeah you should because no one else has really made it and now look no one else has really made it and now i'm i've made it and now everyone wants to make it y'all have had this in your stash for what two years two years thank you she she it's giving thank you ask your friend if she can make me a shirt from that uh, her name is Grace of Zesty Couture. You can reach out to her to see if she has any more of this fabric. Can someone put Grace's name in the chat, please? Or someone tell Grace to get her ass in here. <laughs> um, she does do custom commissions. She do Grace does do custom commissions. She does. Uh, thank y'all. Thank y'all. So yeah, I, again, I just have to put in buttons or a zipper. So don't judge the front too much. I know it's bunched up. That's because I literally have it safety pinned. Um, but aside from that and, and hemming, hemming the sleeves in the bottom and doing buttons or zippers, it's done and fix and finishing the collar. I mean, I'm really happy with it. I'm really happy with it. Yeah. Yeah, this is it. This is this is it. I I try to tell y'all. <laughs> it may take me a little bit. It may take me a little bit, but listen, I I can sew. <laughs> People think I just do headbands and in canteen dresses. I can sew, okay? <laughs> It might not be on Shishi's level. It might not be on Miss Carol's level, but I or Julia's level, but I can sew. It might not be on Will's level. Shit, I can sew. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Anyway, y'all. Thank you, Kay. <laughs> I do love buttons, Sabs. Sabs, now that I know how to do buttons, Julian gave me a very thorough tutorial on my machine. Now I'm like, let me put buttons on everything. Let me put buttons on everything. <laughs> Thank you, Amanda. Thank you, Shishi. I appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> anyway, y'all. Um, I've been on here for seven hours and 42 minutes. <laughs> uh, thank you, Miss Carol. Thank you. I did finish it. I did. Y'all want to see one last look? Y'all want to see one last look? I'll stay on for like 20 more minutes so I can get my agency hours. <laughs> this is it. This is the finished almost finished jumpsuit it's almost finished yeah it's cute yeah yeah y'all can't tell me nothing y'all can't tell me nothing the pockets are nice yeah i remember I remember when this pattern first came out, there was this sewist. She has her own YouTube channel and she did a whole review of the Nomi patterns. And she essentially tore each and every single Nomi pattern apart in her YouTube video. She tore the Nomi patterns apart. Her comment section tore the Nomi patterns apart, tore the designers apart. It was ugly. It was it was really, really ugly. And I remember the commentary that they said about this pattern, Norris's pattern, um, wasn't very nice. And she, one of the comments was, 
oh, you have to be careful what color you make it in because it you can't make it in orange because then it'll look like, you know, he was in jail or like a jail jumpsuit, which um, to make that comment about a black male designer was just in poor taste and a little racist. <clears throat> but I saw this pattern and immediately saw the potential. It took me a while to make it just because of life and motivation and other stuff. But the point of that story and the point of me even bringing it up now is that sometimes you have to have the vision and that woman and the people in her comment section, they might know how to sew and they might be sewists, but they don't have the vision to see the potential for a lot of patterns. And if you look through their Instagram and you look through their work, I can't look through her Instagram because she's blocked, um, but it's dry. It is dry. It is stale. It is uninspired. It is old prints and old fashions because they don't have the vision. So all I'm saying is just because you see a pattern on an envelope and it might not look like something you would be able to pull off or it might, the styling might look bad or you might try to see the potential, try to look at it and say, okay, how can I make this for me? How can I make this in my style? Because I'll tell you, um, so Your View is currently doing a challenge. They're doing Erica Bunker's blazer. Her blazer is cut out in the back, cut out in the sides. It is sexy, sexy, hoochie mama. And when I saw the blazer, I liked it. I liked it a lot. However, I was like, with my skill level, there's no way I would be able to do it. And a lot of other people were like, I like it and I could do it, but it's not my style. And it wasn't until Carmen and um, So Your View and, and Monica, mainly Carmen, got together and they were like, hey, you don't have to take the blazer as is. You can take this blazer and you can make it fit for your age, for your comfort level, for your style. And then they posted a reel of all the different hacks that you could do to the blazer. You could add mesh lining, you can add rhinestones. There was one with this cute little pink bow and it just opened up everyone's mind. It opened up everyone's opinions. And the comment section was filled with people being like, oh my gosh, I never thought of that. Oh my gosh, now I wanna get the pattern. Oh my gosh, this, oh my gosh, that. You don't have to take the pattern at face value. You can add your own spin and your own excitement to it. Um, so, yeah, think outside the... I, literally, E-Rose, I was just about to say, think outside the box. <laughs> think outside the box and try something new. Uh, because I really think that's what we did with this pattern. We took this pattern that no one wanted to make. And look, now everyone's saying they want to make it. <laughs> It's okay to listen, Tajri. Thank you. Thank you, Beverly. Listen, Tajri. Y'all can see right up my nose. <laughs> um, this was very impromptu. Very impromptu. I mean, it was scheduled for today, but I didn't really announce it. I just I just hopped on and said, let me do my thing. Thank you. I'll show you. This is it. I still have to add my buttons on my zipper, but this is it, y'all. This is one last, one last look. Almost one last look. This is Ankara fabric from Grace of Zesty Couture. And this is how it looks. This is how it looks. It's cute. Thank you, Carmen. So, yeah, I really, I just want y'all to challenge yourselves. Try new things. If I can come out of my comfort zone, y'all can come out of your comfort zone. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> that is all I'm saying. And I'll tell you, one place that I look for inspiration is Pinterest. Pinterest is one place that I look for inspiration all the time. Um, yeah, I... 
a dress that I made at the end of January was a Pinterest inspiration. That floral one with the off the shoulder with the puff sleeves that I saw on Pinterest and decided I wanted to recreate it. And I love that dress. So I say all that to say, take chances, try new things. Um, don't let what, not that this is styled poorly because I love the way that this is, I love the way that it looks. I love the way that it's styled. But, you know, don't let that stop you or dictate you from buying the pattern or not buying the pattern because you can add your own little spin and twist to it. Hey, K Bella. Listen, you can you can do it up. We you can do it up. <laughs> I wish I would have done this pattern earlier so y'all could have got it. I don't know if they still have it at Joanne's. So you could have got it during the sale, but too little too late now. <laughs> Faith, thank you so much for sharing the live. Thank you to everyone who was watching on YouTube also. It's so exciting. <laughs> An almost eight hour live. I'm sure my watch hours will be plentiful today. <laughs> Does anyone else have any other questions about the pattern? I'll stay on for a few more minutes. You look so nice this afternoon. Thank you. Yeah, I'll stay on for about 10 more minutes. What am I making next? Is green my favorite color? No, it's not. Uh, what am I making next? I am working on my knit fabric. So I'm trying to, this week I really wanna focus on like basics. So I really wanna do like active wear, um, sweatpants, sweatshirts, tank tops, t-shirts with my knit fabric. So that is my, that is my focus. I really would just wanna do loungewear this week. Can I model it again? Yeah, I can. I can. One second. So yeah, this week is going to be focused on loungewear. I really want to take it easy. <laughs> I feel like I've been busting. Have y'all seen all the stuff I've made since the beginning of this month? I've made one, two, three, four, four dresses, a jumpsuit. Five dresses, a jumpsuit, a cardigan, three tops. Now this, now this jumpsuit. I've been, I've been a busy little bee. I've been a busy little bee. Yes, I finished it. I finished it. Yep. Well, it's almost finished. I have to add a zipper. I have to add a zipper or buttons. But aside from that, we are almost. We're almost finished with it. I'm happy with how it turned out. Really, really happy with how it turned out. Thank you. Thank you all so much. Thank you all, thank you all. Yeah, I just have to add the button or zipper and then I just have to hem the sleeves in the bottom, finish the collar and it'll be done. We're like 90, 99% of the way done. Thank you. Yes, there are back pockets. There are back pockets. Not that I use them, but they're here. So there's two back pockets. There's these side pockets, and then there is a pocket here. So... You have one, two, three, four, five pockets. Three exterior and two interior pockets. And they were really, really easy to put on, really easy to assemble. So, 
And again, the pattern is No Me 2012. And again, I cut the smallest size because I wanted it more fitted. So I cut the 34. Thank you, Christina. Loving the bald look. Thank you. <laughs> I'm cute or whatever. Thanks. Mary, thank you so much for the rose. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. YouTube, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. We are at eight hours, so I'm going to end the stream on YouTube. Uh, thank you to everyone who stayed and watched. I really appreciate it. Um, you definitely, <laughs> definitely don't have to sit and watch the, the replay <laughs> if you don't want to, because baby, eight hours, that's a, that's a whole day. <laughs> that is a whole day, but thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Bye, YouTube. <laughs>